we are back with you after a short break. And uh, now uh, Sandra suggested that uh, we check women's section. So <laughs> now, Sandra, you are, you are choosing the games and... Uh, yes, okay. We can check uh, Kostenyuk uh, against Ovod because uh, I think something is... Yeah, in the meantime, happened a lot. Mm. It, seems, yes. uh, it seems that uh, seems it uh, we, we were actually stopping after 98, mm -hmm. if I remember good, and then we were s saying something mm -hmm. about uh, possible idea to play G6 and uh, 95, and then, and then mm -hmm. something like this. Actually, uh, here, yeah, Alexander actually mm -hmm. played Bishop G4 move, mm -hmm. which is uh, actually, it, it seems also quite good because maybe 95 sometimes is threat. And uh, also, 95 was looking quite good. Uh, I mean, like very logical from uh, uh, Evgenia. But yeah, now G6 looking. happened very good. Mm -hmm. Seems very nice, yeah? Because mm -hmm. now the main problem for uh, Black is actually this pawn on E6. If knight G6 happens, then uh, knight E6 is actually winning mm -hmm. the game. F6, bishop E6, king, king H8, H8, and uh, the end would be like queen H5 mate, yeah. So after g6, it seems that uh, uh, she was in big trouble. Okay, knight g4 would be somehow logical choice, but uh, maybe it's tough to find uh, uh, something after queen g4. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess that now knight f6 is logical, gf7 check. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or first, uh, in that moment, uh, uh, before uh, queen g4, maybe first to play. Mm -hmm. GFC. Okay. It's uh, the same, I but I was thinking about that. Yeah, but maybe so actually here White has extra option mm -hmm. because after yes, okay. knight f6, uh, it's very interesting mm -hmm. to play queen h3 mate. Mm -hmm. Queen h3 because, uh, because of rook f6 mm -hmm. mate on h7. Queen, queen and now the problem would be that after fg6, it's possible maybe to take knight e6. Although mm -hmm. there is some always there is some contraplay mm -hmm. with bishop c8, knight c7, bishop h3. Let's say, but knight a8, and it seems that. Uh, this should be winning for uh, for white mm -hmm. because obviously that after bishop f1, uh, knight b6 is one option. But uh, this looks like tough position even if just white continues to play now mm -hmm. uh, strategically, just playing a4, b3. I mean, mm -hmm. it looks like this b6 pawn is weak and, uh, and these double g pawns are not helping so much. Mm -hmm. okay. So some move like a4 would be very very nice. Uh, uh, for white, I mean, it's a very nice position to white. And uh, now, okay, g6, okay, bishop c8 uh, uh, was uh, played in the game, but it seems gf7, it's rook f7, yeah. 96, very nice sacrifice. Mm -hmm. Obviously, now that uh, after bishop e6, this is uh, close to, I mean, it should be lost position after bishop e6, king e6. I just, mm, I guess just that if you just after queen d5, you don't try. You don't have to try to give the mate. Mm -hmm. You can just simply take on a8. And uh, okay. it's exchange. It's hanging on d5 mm -hmm. check. I mean, it's hanging on e8. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, it's lost position. Yeah, yeah, yeah. White. So knight e6, queen c4, and knight d5. But this also looks very, very tough for uh, for Evgenia. It seems that Alexandra will uh, win this mm -hmm. game. Okay. For a few so. minutes, maybe. Yeah, okay, now it's, it's questionable. I don't know. Maybe queen e4 is the best chance. Yeah, what mm -hmm. else to play? And uh, here, white also has to be careful because bishop on g4, not so many I mean, pieces are hanging uh, everywhere. So it's uh, mm -hmm. it should be something precise. Uh, so maybe. let's see. Maybe <laughs> do you have some ex suggestion maybe about this position, what to play? Because also queen g4 looks. Uh, Looks a uh, big threat. I'm just looking. There should be some some mating mm, idea. It looks I like it's completely winning, but um, maybe move per move. Yeah, it's uh -huh. not so easy. This is exactly actually for Sicilian defense. This is uh, uh, if you missed one move, mm -hmm. it's uh, it can be it can be just a decisive mistake. You know. Yeah, it's for chess. You can play thirty moves. Yeah. Very yeah. good, but one move can. Uh, can decide again. Mm. Yeah, it's so okay. This still does not look like uh, completely lost. I mean, uh, in the practical game, maybe. I mean, computer is probably here showing something, mm -hmm. but uh, 
Uh, yeah, it's uh, actually I see the idea, so maybe, maybe this check is check making. First. Yeah, this mm -hmm. is the problem actually, because now the black cannot make knight f6 because of knight mm -hmm. g5. Going back, bishop f6 is also met with knight g5, mm -hmm. and, uh, and queen is king, uh, g6 or g8. G8. It's hanging on e7. Mm -hmm. So ah, okay. I mean, basically, <coughs> this is the the mate. Sorry. Yeah, so. It seems that queen e4, the only move. Mm -hmm. Maybe actually Evgenia missed queen f1 check in the previous calculation maybe. before she took on mm -hmm. a, even a, in this position, maybe she missed it because this was something like gf7, rook f7, and some mm -hmm. sacrifice on e6 you expect it when you are mm -hmm. uh, playing uh, this, pos this position. If you go to some complications, mm -hmm. especially, and now it seems that simply she forgot about queen f1, and uh, uh, I don't see the way she will. Uh, avoid the loss, so I think that this uh, game will, will be s mm -hmm. uh, very soon over, as you and were uh, saying before. First so first uh, win today in this uh, match for Legacy Square. Okay, Kostenyuk is uh, playing uh, very good here. Yeah, yeah, but also, and I mean, uh, it's, uh, it seems that, uh, uh, I mean, somehow uh, Evgenia did not play the, the best game, mm -hmm. because somehow from the opening and the so on and giving uh, Maybe s uh, still she was t just, you know, when once when you miss these tactical mm -hmm. ideas and especially since Kostinyuk is really trying always to play on attack and so on, it it's can be, It's not know easy to play against Kostinyuk, but our friend Angelia Stojanovic won. Oh, really? Nice. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so, uh, okay, maybe you have some uh, other suggestion, maybe to mm -hmm. check this uh, first... Uh, uh, first match, I mean, top boards, because okay. uh, we, we were speaking check. about some... Uh, I, I think we were speaking about uh, games of uh, Jagnidze, Jagnidze and yes. And and yeah, okay. this is uh, this is very uh, very interesting game, I mean, because we were speaking about this, uh, whether she will choose mm -hmm. to take uh, with pawn on d5 or not, and uh, they played the many moves uh, mm -hmm. after the last time we checked the position, and bishop e6 happened, queen d3. Uh, we did not discuss about this move actually. We were saying cd5 and knight f3, but okay, queen d3, knight d7, cd5. In my opinion, white should have a slight advantage mm -hmm. here, but um, it's uh, not uh, really something big and also mm -hmm. maybe simply move per move. I'm wrong, I mean, maybe just uh, tactic, uh, some tactical idea mm -hmm. there, uh, there in position which I, uh, which I missed. So f4. I don't like that move. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's uh, uh, somehow White should uh, try to use the fact uh, that this b5 mm -hmm. square Not is... Not uh, to play on king side. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, because f4, f5 is actually helping to black because this mm -hmm. bishop from e6 is getting extra square f7. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, I mean, uh, white knight is not so dangerous on e5 mm -hmm. while I mean uh, knight on e4 is uh, I think more dangerous simply mm -hmm. since uh, b3 a5 if you if we look in at the pawn structure okay it seems that uh, black has just a slight really really slight edge in pawn structure mm -hmm. because this pawn on a5 and b3 if the position uh, if you are looking like this mm -hmm. it seems like a little bit more space mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But yes. uh, let's see what happened. Rook f c one, queen b six, knight f three, rook f c eight, e three, knight f six, bishop f one, knight e four, bishop e one, and now also in meantime, rook c seven was played by uh, Ushenina. Okay, I, now it should be. I think that black should uh, black is staying good here. That mm -hmm. uh, she equalized. I mean, but uh, okay, still. Somehow for uh, now the main problem for Nana is how to take over the C line, the C line. because mm -hmm. next move obviously will be Rook C8. I guess that Rook C2 can be normal try here. Mm -hmm. And now let's say after Rook C8, Rook C1, and uh, it looks still that uh, position is just equal. Mm -hmm. I mean, because since uh, in this position, even Black can play Bishop D7 move. Mm -hmm. That just e6 bishop f8 completely the same plan which uh, Nana did with the white pieces. So, I mean, uh, yeah, this is a possibility. Yeah, uh, so rook c2, queen c2, and rook c8. Yeah, this is what I missed. I mean, this is uh, mm -hmm. obviously possible. And okay, queen b2. We 
to threaten queen yeah with a queen a3 three three idea or rook c1 mm -hmm. it's also i mean something uh, queen a3 i uh, it's just i mean it's threat because uh, then two pounds would be hanging mm -hmm. e7 and a5 but uh, also it's questionable whether queen this c7 i can't play yeah yeah it's, it's questionable six, yeah does a2. this e7 pawn is actually mm -hmm. hanging because uh, Queen will, uh, after some bishop f8, queen will go to h4 because there is no space for the queen. But, uh, mm -hmm. okay, rook c7, it seems that uh, uh, Nana m somehow uh, missed the uh, advantage. Exactly. I, think, I think she played uh, one more move. She played queen b5 in this I position. I was thinking about this move, but uh, I don't know after queen b5, bishop b5. Okay, it's hanging on a5. This is the, sorry. Uh -huh. I think it's hanging, hanging on, a, on ah, a5, okay, and this is the, the this is the point of her point. play. But okay, uh, okay. Yeah, for example, mm -hmm. sorry, uh, a little bit my mouse is <laughs> too fast for me. So, <laughs> rook c1, rook c1, yeah, it's uh, and rook c7. Well, yeah, queen b5. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, uh, while we were speaking, I completely missed this move. I, uh, Okay, another another option maybe after queen b5, bishop b5, rook c1, rook c1 is actually to just continue defending with knight d6 and simply to try to push uh, a4 at some point. Uh, uh, yeah, it's, uh, maybe after bishop d3 still white is uh, pressuring because uh, it seems that the c line is uh, really key mm -hmm. uh, in this position. If you get uh, some pressure over c line, it will be dangerous. On the other side, maybe I this... I can play a4, because uh, in this moment, if you play after these changes or not, something like uh, rook c7, no. I can just play king... Uh, uh, it's dangerous, maybe knight g5 after king of 8 or... But okay, okay, bishop yeah, f6. Yeah, bishop f6, yeah, but exactly this position, I'm not so sure what is mm -hmm. happening, because bishop b4 and now... Uh, uh, eventually, if you want to open mm -hmm. a line, yeah, you have to take a b a b. But it mm -hmm. seems that it's you are not getting uh, uh, not so much by giving g2, rook a one, just king g two, king mm -hmm. h three. Exactly. I mean, mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's very good. I mean, it's now and bishop d six is big threat because pawn mm -hmm. is on d seven hanging. I, anyway, even if uh, like would like defend the pawn, like really passive move, mm -hmm. like rook b eight with idea yeah, bishop d six e d six. I mean, yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. I mean, even I can play move like knight g5, mm -hmm. and now I forced you basically to do something with this bishop from e6. Mm -hmm. uh, after bishop c8, for example, mm -hmm. I can play move like, uh, uh, let's say, bishop. Uh, uh, even even I can play knight f7 actually, and it's hanging the pawn. Mm -hmm. And after knight g5, if you are forced to go in such a kind of end games like bishop g5, f g5, okay, this it's looks. Not playable for. Um, yeah, yeah, it looks bad. I mean. Mm -hmm. So, so at the end we can see that uh, yeah, white... It seems uh, queen b5 is yeah, a very mm -hmm. unpleasant move. Mm -hmm. uh, it seems that also uh, she missed it. So maybe here was actually more precise maybe to put this rook to c6 for example. I mean uh, it looks maybe uh, a little bit uh, less logical uh -huh. but uh, because now it, what uh, uh, she could get here is basically that queen b5 is not so strong move because I can play queen c7 mm -hmm. maybe. And now after rook c6, basically I will take with the pawn and I will and push c5. c5. Mm -hmm. So maybe something like this, but uh, still uh, this structure... You can play rook c1. Uh, yeah, rook c1, exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly, rook c1 can be the one of the problems in this mm -hmm. position. So maybe here still, I mean, queen b5. Uh, my original idea was actually to take one b5 and simply to play rook b6 move. Mm -hmm. uh, rook is a little bit uh, uh, strange on this uh, mm -hmm. square, but after a4 I have knight d6, knight d6. and uh, simply pawn on b3 is hanging. Knight, uh, uh, rook c5? Yeah, rook c5, but yeah, it's possible, but I can simply play. <laughs> no, but I, I <laughs> think I can, no, yeah, I can play also Just knight kidding. b5, yes, a b5, okay. bishop d7, mm -hmm. you will take on a5, mm -hmm. I will take on b5, probably it will be close to draw. But, um, uh, yeah, it seems that if uh, she moves some bishop, let's say, to d3, mm -hmm. maybe then some a4 is a uh, mm -hmm. fast counterplay. Yes. Or even because king f8, king d8. Uh, b7 yeah, rook b6 does mm -hmm. not look so bad, I mean. Uh, however, she played rook c7, so I mean, now she it seems that she is in trouble, actually, because it was played already queen b5, queen b5, bishop b5, and uh, 
now, yeah, it it's, seems that... It's uh, hard to find some... It's always like mm -hmm. slightly better for white. I mean, yes. white always has one tempo, mm -hmm. I mean, to, and to try to play on advantage. So, unpleasant position, I think, for uh, Anna. Uh, although, as I said before, the whole, this maneuver which uh, Nana was doing was not so impressive, but it seems now that uh, after Queen B5, now everything is going on, the, mm -hmm. yeah, everything is going, uh, like, uh, going like she mm -hmm. wanted. So, okay, in this game, it's, uh, it will be tough, uh, tough job to save the draw for, uh, to save draw we can for see Shane Shane. Now. Yeah, yeah, she's she now is thinking, a yeah. maybe worried. She's uh, thinking. Maybe calculating something. Okay, uh, yes, I'm just. Yeah, maybe you have some other idea which uh, game we should check in uh, in the women's section. Maybe in mm -hmm. this match there is also some interesting game. Uh, maybe... Maybe Kotenashvili Pogonina. Uh -huh, Kotenashvili Pogonina, mm -hmm. yeah. This, uh, I mean, uh, Pogonina I has uh, white pieces. Mm -hmm. Yesterday she lost this important game against, against uh, Kostenyuk. Yeah, mm -hmm. It seems that this was the... Today she is a g uh, she's a white and she was white uh, yeah, yeah. yesterday. It's a good thing for her. Yeah, yeah, and after uh, E4, yeah, you can see just the opening we saw. Uh, ah, yeah, this is very interesting. Today we see the open right Lopez mm -hmm. was, and uh, here the interesting line with Queen E2 idea mm -hmm. is to play Rook D1 and C4. It seems to me that this is a interesting uh, setup for white generally. Mm -hmm. And this is all theory, actually. Uh, H6, I think it's not the theory. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it's not the main move. I think that after bishop b3, the main move is uh, rook d8 or exactly queen maybe here, queen b6. Mm -hmm. I'm not 100% uh, sure, but I think it's uh, the line is going like this. Mm -hmm. But uh, okay, bishop b3, h6 was played, and uh, this is very tough position for, for, uh, black? for black, yeah. Mm -hmm. Probably Natalia could play better at some point, but uh, let's see the final position. Rook g4, mm -hmm. queen b2. Hmm. Now it seems that uh, actually black got some counterplay here. Mm, I'm not so sure about white's advantage anymore here. So mm -hmm. somewhere she she made she a mistake. Missed. Yeah, mm -hmm. she missed something. Yeah. So but okay, Bella is playing mm -hmm. very good this tournament. Yes. So it seems that you mm -hmm. know when you are playing good, uh, then uh, also you need one uh, uh, small amount of mm -hmm. luck to to become the best. Yes. And uh, it seems that now even uh, in first we saw this game of Nana mm -hmm. and somehow we were not so impressed by her play but she is now slightly mm -hmm. better and then we have this uh, game of uh, Kotenashvili. Kotenashvili where she, it seems that she didn't know really mm -hmm. good theory but uh, now she got now again very very nice mm -hmm. position. And uh, now it's, uh, we have nice uh, news yeah. for you. Uh, soon with us will be Grandmaster Ivan Sokolov. So we will take a very short break and uh, Sandra will have <laughs> some uh, bigger break, I think 30 yeah. minutes. Yeah. Okay. okay, see you for, see you for minutes. a few minutes. Welcome to chess.com. Chess.com is social. Now you can play chess with your friends whenever you want, whether that's middle of the day or middle of the night. You can get instantly matched up with one of over 5 million other members from around the world. You play live games in real time, turn-based games at your convenience, or tournaments with anyone at any time. Chess.com is mobile. You can play online from your computer, or you can play on the go from your tablet or your smartphone. No matter where you go, whether you're at work, grabbing a bite to eat, or you're just enjoying some time at the park, your games are there with you, and keeping multiple chess games going has never been easier. Chess.com is for learning. Don't just play chess, get better. The best chess training resources have never been more accessible. Learn essential chess strategy quickly and easily with the extremely popular Tactics Trainer Tool. Improve your game in ways you didn't know were possible with training videos by chess masters. And regardless of where you're at now, take your game to the next level with multiple simple to use training tools. Chess.com is for everyone. Over 250 million chess games have been played on Chess.com. And it doesn't matter if you're a beginner or a grandmaster. Chess.com is the place to play and learn chess. So create your free account now and see what Chess.com is for you.
and we are back. With us is uh, a new guest, Grandmaster Ivan Sokolov. First of all, hello. Hi, Boki, thank hello. you. So, for, uh, how do you feel here in Skopje? I remember that we see each other here two years ago on the yes, Open I Tournament. I feel good. I came here, uh, my role actually here, I'm Chief of Appeals. And so far, no appeals. No appeals, yeah. So, so far, everything <laughs> is good. So now, let's watch it some chess, you know. Yeah. Not so bad, so <laughs> yeah. I pass by to try to hand your help you out a bit, uh, yeah. just uh, not to be alone this yeah. uh, for some time. So, sh what should we do? Which game should we take? Uh, yeah, I think that we should start from the first uh, board, I mean, from first the match, yeah, from the top, okay. yeah. Is, uh, so it, I didn't check in the playing hall, is Kramnik the only one who is having this famous lamp or somebody else also? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Kramnik is the only one. Yeah, but uh, still, I, I, I don't think that they were che that they were checking it and cheating this uh, stuff. I think okay. they did not check the lamp. I mean, they checked the old players, but uh, uh, no, the, lamp, uh, the lamp was bought by organizers, not, uh -huh. by, not by Vladi. So I think <laughs> that it should be safe. Uh, yes, I see that it's still there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have this. Uh, I was wondering this the follow game uh, in the opening. East move a three and novelty. Did you ever see yeah. this before? I I have never seen it. I mean, it should be novelty, right? And maybe they maybe they were playing at some point, but on the highest level for sure. Yeah, I for never sure saw it. Yes, yeah, yeah, because it was uh, also surprising to me. So okay, he jumped ninety four. Yeah, ninety four. Yeah, this is exactly bishop g two, bishop d six. Because otherwise, bishop g five was the mm -hmm. possible option. And now, uh, basically, we were going through this position. In my opinion, is somehow that Topalo wanted to avoid uh, the normal setups, mm -hmm. and okay. that somehow he got it basically with knight c three. Maybe. Okay. Now castle knight b5, and we stopped here when I actually offered c5 as the the most sensible option. However, Leko yeah. preferred to play knight c6 move. Okay, so with knight c6, actually he is giving him choice to take a bishop pair, or if he doesn't take, uh, well, he might move the bishop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is exactly what happened. He did not take on d6. Mm, I don't know. Maybe he after knight d6, queen d6. Maybe there is some problems because uh. still. Why did not develop the pieces? Maybe we should be two, but two. now I'm not so sure. Maybe something with bishop a6 can bishop be. Bishop a6, rook c1. Yeah, this is maybe, and some now taking on d2, but maybe the king. King is. If I, how would you take advantage of this king? He will take, I will take mm. back. And maybe some knight a5, for example. Moment, moment, moment. Uh -huh, you normally you take on d2, I take on c6. c6, yeah, 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 yeah. this is uh, dangerous. Well, this Don't looks. Interesting. The Palov did not want to do this, so he played what? He played b4. B4, yeah, and, and now, now Leko moved the bishop. Yeah. Okay. And this is now after e3. Okay, a5. Still, I I cannot believe now that black should be worse here, but uh, uh, structure no, is a little bit strange. Uh, okay. B5, rook. Yes. This looks everything like quite normal. Queen d7. Mm -hmm. Queen b3. Yeah. Okay, King H8 moving from yes, E4 from pin, king. yeah, and uh, now Knight E4, F4, Bishop D2, Rook A6. This is where they stopped. I think that there was not played. Yeah, and Castle was last move, actually. Black looks, black looks okay. Maybe it was maybe maybe even better, yeah. Maybe Knight A5. Uh, yeah, I don't see actually because the big idea. You need to take Knight 5 yeah. You cannot yeah, allow Knight C4. Rook yes. takes. Black looks uh, at least equal. Yeah, we are maybe missing something, but. Uh, this looks very good. I don't know. Because a pawn is weak. You have uh, two bishops. Yeah, okay, only chance is probably now to push a4. I mean, what else? Yeah, but okay, a4, if, if I double. If, if I yeah, this is, uh, this is tricky. Maybe rook c1. Rook c1 yeah. is tempo, and then this is... Uh, but maybe I can just play bishop d8 mm -hmm. in this position. Why not to defend? I mean, because I guess that c6, knight c3 would be yes. the point, main point. Yeah, this would and be then probably C6 even C6 even C6 that C6 when you play bishop d8 doesn't look uh, no really but okay bishop d8 first and then c6 if you need yeah. or not yeah it's uh, would be very strange if black is having many problems here because now okay after bishop d8 to start with you want to take a pawn yeah 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 it's yeah it's so you have to go back I guess knight c3 yeah, on the pawn. I, I get I guess yeah. even knight c3 looks the most I mean rook a1 looks uh, a little bit strange yeah, it's yeah. strange what topple of this because uh, I don't think that he really got uh, what he wanted. Yeah, actually, knight a5, bishop a5, rook a5 happened. This happened, yeah? Yeah, knight uh, yeah, no, I see on the video that already Topol oh, took on a5, yeah, but... Uh, there, there is rook on a5, this is right. And... and uh, how is time? Uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, tough to see, yeah. So uh, maybe the. It's like 21 minutes for Tapalo for 22, and 12 minutes for Lecco. Oh, so Tapalo is having time advantage, but uh, that position is. He easy. does not have position advantage. This is for sure. Yeah, and, and maybe he would manage to confuse. Uh, but it's very hard. I mean, <laughs> when you don't have so many pieces. Ah, bishop a5, rook a5. Now we get also here. And uh, I think that it is go probably going to happen what we predicted. Yeah, yeah. Th there is very good chance because what are you going to do here? I mean, I would double. You would need to play this move. Yeah, yeah, a4, a4 but what else? Yeah, yeah, a4, yeah, and just going back. I mean, I mean you can maybe, let's say... Uh, yeah, no kfc1, we were saying just first. Move, delay yeah. this by one move, but uh, ultimately... Yeah, you this get this come. position, yeah. Some position like this is going to come, and here I have a different options, maybe even bishop a6. Uh, yeah, this is what I thought. Maybe then white has to defend yes. bishop f1 because but otherwise the... Yeah, but if you change bishop f1, I might take and then... Uh, h5 maybe. Yes, yeah. and then maybe think about your king. Yeah, h5, g6, just slowly. Yeah. I mean, here at least h5 maybe or queen yeah. h3, something like this. Oh, but he's doing good. This is... Uh, yeah, even sure. yeah, even after c6, you cannot do anything against yeah. these two weak pawns. I mean, it's... Uh, Only question how good, but uh, looks like very good position. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't think that like we'll have the problems here. No, uh, let's uh, check some other top uh, boards or, or continuing in this match. Actually. Yeah, yeah, this Board match too, maybe because it is important match. Who is sitting there? Yeah, Caruana. Yeah, yeah, and uh, maybe we can start with uh, okay. actually game of Washir because today okay. is his birthday and he was sacrificing everything. So <laughs> we can see a little bit what what happened. I mean, what uh, what is your score on your birthdays? Oh, very bad. Very I bad. think maybe I made a couple of draws and some losses, but uh, usually I'm not doing good. Uh, uh, I, st I started off very well on my birthdays and then uh, <laughs> I became very confident and then I lost a couple of games. So and now I'm very careful on my birthdays. Yeah, so now, now we are trying to avoid it, I guess. I do yes, not, uh, uh, well, if I have to play, then I, I will play, but right. still. Let's <laughs> see, it was here. Yeah. Oh my god, everything is open. King yeah, is yeah, open. We, we were actually. He sacrificed Rook, yeah? Yeah, we stopped here after f5. Okay, this looks promising, nice yeah. and strong. And now it happened g5, rook f5. Yeah. Okay, this is really concrete. Yes. Knight b6, rook g5, I guess only because otherwise I will take on d5. I, I don't see the another point, yeah? And now f5. I mean, it, everything looks very, very concrete. Mm -hmm. And uh, queen e1. Queen Still, one. I, don't, I don't see, I mean, f4. I, if I go somewhere with knight, f4 is coming. I mean, but so here he had other moves like uh, this, not d6, the knight e6, yeah? Yeah, yeah, after d6 looks very unpleasant, yeah, knight g6, six, six, and, and, uh, is big tempo and, everything is and now even after rook g7, I have knight g7, mm -hmm. I don't have to even do anything with my king, but uh, yeah, okay, I thought so maybe somehow to take on c5, but it does not look really dangerous, maybe bishop c5, but uh, after fe4, I guess this is idea. Yes. And yeah, now even bishop f8, queen g5 is hanging, yeah, even I cannot, yes. I don't okay. have even time for this, yeah. This mm -hmm. uh, this is not so good, yeah. But okay, Queen E1, he played like for 10 seconds, like... So fast, yes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also Rook G5 was for two minutes, so <laughs> it was... What did you <laughs> see? Moment, Rook G5, okay, Queen E1, yes, okay. Rajabov took. F E4, and now Rook, rook G7. G7, looks logical after King Queen yeah. E1. What else? Check. King G8. Okay, first of all, let's figure out uh, whether after Queen E5, White is having at least a draw. This is always good to, to sort yeah, of yeah, yeah, yeah. just to take a stop. But maybe I do, because uh, okay, look, uh, your problem is that rook on b8 hangs also. Yeah, after so queen f6, queen seven. Yeah, yeah. And of rook f6, bishop g5. Yeah, this looks uh, And now okay, you, you cannot yeah. move knight because rook is hanging on b8. Yeah, and uh, okay, no, but I can play knight d7. What if I play tempo? If you play tempo... But now, now I can also now take, I can take. take, take, take and yes, rook f1. Yeah, but you cannot take by queen because it hangs, rook f1. Yeah. And I would now regain material, king g7, knight e4. Yeah, yeah, and, and I think it's the end. Yes, probably Actually, the end. this is the end, yeah. This yeah, king g7, queen g5. Check. Yeah, even, even, even I can take rook f6 actually here. Yes. I mean, it's, uh, even this is, it seems that this is working yeah. because it yeah, the rook on b8 piece. exactly is mm -hmm. yep. hanging all the time. But maybe so. you handle them, maybe he's winning by force. Okay, but what Check, if he so plays king, king g8 back? But now he has to f you have to find something. King g8. Uh, mm -hmm. Still queen f6 doesn't look as a threat because it's uh, hanging on c7. I mean. How about to uh, move like bishop h6? It is normally always good to threaten a mate in one. Mm, yeah, but I thought that this is defensive idea now. Queen g3 check. 
Yeah, in King Gage 8. And what is King this? King Gage 8, okay, I take, if on I take, on take a Maybe rook f1? He's oh. just winning on the sp ah, queen uh, no, f4. Uh, no, rook f1, queen h6. Uh, so uh -huh, no, sorry, I, I yeah. take a rook, I take on f8, and then I take a knight. Yeah, this is bad. And uh, the end. I mean, rook is coming to f1. We have the same material, and I'm attacking. Yeah, and uh, these pounds are rook not looking seven. so good. Rook b7, probably. But queen e5 is queen okay, e5 one check. check. Okay, you have to now put some piece. Queen. Maybe queen, queen g7. seven. You probably need to play. You cannot go on the pin. But okay, it looks pleasant choice actually. For yeah, but you're white. kicking. Okay, you're kicking with black. If I consolidate. Uh, okay, but maybe it's just simply check. I mean, on e8. Check queen g8. Yeah, and now okay. Maybe I think the team just yeah yeah. If you take queen e4, you're clearly better, right? I think it's yeah, but you everything is hanging. You got back your pawns. stuff, and all the pawns are weak, and king is open. Yeah, yeah this looks very promising. Yeah, this really. looks very good. But so what uh, what else I mean to do after queen e5? We stopped for king g8, bishop h6. Okay, okay, rook f7 also looks normal, but somehow bishop, bishop h5, h5, h5 it's uh, it doesn't look like. Uh okay, this looks very good. Oh, wait, 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 wait! But rook f5, maybe we are. Ah, rook no, f5, queen g3 one. is mate. Oh, mate one, g7. Oh, queen seven. Sorry, oh, sorry, sorry. This is not. Uh, yeah, yeah. This looks bad. Look, well, maybe uh, maybe. Lashier is simply very smart to do this stuff on his birthday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 uh, yeah. This game can finish in uh, not too many moves. L let's see. Maybe they played some move. Ah, they played actually. Video there. Do we have anything? Do we have any moves there? Yeah, yeah. Queen g3 actually happened. He played queen f6. Queen f6. Okay. Queen c7. 97. 97. Okay, this is Okay, so Rajabov good. decided to go for a exchange up position, but now it must be tremendous compensation. How do I move this bishop from e3 to c3? Well, okay. Then is the end. If then I the can end. manage that, uh, then we are done. No, no, then it's. Uh, but uh, maybe I can start, let's say we're playing with rook f1. Rook f1, yeah. That's, uh, Just to try possible? to remove one of your defenders. Yeah, okay. I have to go, I guess, on e7 or g7. Yeah. Well, you either have to move queen, or you need to play move like rook b7. Oh, yeah, rook b7 is possible, but... Uh, Look, it looks shaky, shaky, but yeah. position is shaky. Yeah, yeah uh, that's, uh, that's true, yeah, uh, <laughs> it's not so easy. Uh, I think this is not a position for uh, normal moves. Yeah, and I'm, I'm not so sure, yeah, will or Jabul uh, actually with his... <laughs> will he find okay, it, but yeah? Uh, yeah but Still, it's very dangerous here. Yeah, queen yeah, G3. If I just go back, yeah, this is quite. Queen uh, G3. Okay, Queen G7, G7. You offer some exchange, yeah, and. Ah, still, it's maybe not so easy because it's hanging something. Yeah. Bit two at some point. Maybe yes, I need to maybe be it will not be. It is not so. It is not so simple. Uh, but it looks promising quite. I mean, so, so now, actually, moment. This is a position, right? Queen C7, yeah. Yeah, Queen C7, ID7. This is the last moves. Okay, they were let's playing. see here. Uh, Okay, what you want, you probably want some move like queen e5, yeah? Something like to centralize. Yeah, or exactly what you were saying, rook b7, let's say. Yeah. Or rook b2, rook b2 is okay, rook b2 is the biggest the queen threat. Queen yeah. to find out. Uh, yeah, and okay, now the question is uh, really, uh, if I'm just greedy, I guess bishop c5 is met with rook b7. Yes. M maybe this is his main... Uh, also, defense. if you're greedy, bishop c5, I might take knight c5. If you want to take my rook, I have some dark squares. Ah, rook f7 is played. Uh, rook f1 is played, okay. Rook so rook f1, rook f1. No, rook f1 is a logical move, because look, if you move queen, I'm going to remove one defender on f8. Yeah, yeah. And then I would see what to do. Also very important, my rook is now gone. Actually, if I take on e4, it doesn't hang with the tempo on b2. Yeah. It doesn't really matter. You can take this pawn, uh, who cares? Yeah, that's, uh, that's true, yeah. Okay, now we'll see if he finds actually rook b7. Okay, because let's uh, first think is it necessary? Maybe, maybe it is, because what else can he play? Because, because uh, if, if you, you play, play queen g7, I, I can take on f8. And, yeah. and you are forced to take by queen. You have no other moves. And now I'm there not should sure. be some different moves. Maybe even some positional move like uh, 94, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, 94, yeah, rook b2 is uh, met with. Do white has anything there? Is because it seems rook b1 is now some. Rook b1 is terrible threat. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, okay, the knight e4 is not so clever. But also here it's actually. Yeah. You probably need to take, right? But um, yeah, because after bishop c5, actually, I'm not threatening anything no. with rook f1. This is a. So you take, queen takes. Uh, 
okay, maybe it's time, okay, it looks maybe too positional, but now knight d1 and even going with the bishop, but it looks, uh, it looks too, deep. Too, too deep, yeah. Uh, if you want to go with knight, then at least take a stupid, stupid pawn on a4. Yeah, yeah, actually, <laughs> yeah, yeah, actually, you can start from <laughs> this. Eat something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this uh, this uh, looks very complicated, but uh, I would be, I would be very surprised if White does not have at least enough for the draw. Yeah, okay, but with, with such an open king, it would be very strange. And two bishops. Yeah, and two bishops. Two bishops uh, I mean, uh, it should be that White should have a, a minimum a draw. Yeah. Also, yeah, it's uh, In okay. In practical terms, it's probably also easier to play with White. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. It's uh, just uh, okay on the other side somehow. <laughs> I don't know. It's uh, it seems also that uh, time trouble will be one of yeah. the things which can mm -hmm. be uh, because w I was there, and I remember that uh, Vashir was spending a lot of time in the opening. So it was not like kind easy play. Uh -huh. When he sacrificed okay. this e five, he had like yes. he spent like uh, thirty five minutes plus other time which he got oh, okay. with uh, so he this. So he was thinking uh, very much in advance. Yeah, yeah. So I, I don't think it was something like prepared or something. And maybe well, this is important game actually because if. Uh, Vashir can actually manage to Survive. push this, uh, uh, to, to win the game. That would actually then push Leiko to start playing that position with black for a win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the match situation is going then to push uh, Leiko to do something which he normally doesn't want. Yeah, yeah. To play with black against Apollo for a win. But he would have no choice. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, let's check okay, some, like some other games from this Maybe from this match, this because, match, yeah, this, because is, uh, this is actually maybe a very important match. Uh, yeah, the tournament outcome. I think this is uh, oh also what interesting. Yeah, I'm Karyakin Karana. Yeah, Karana was actually uh, in opening choice by Karyakin was first of all for me a little bit strange. And then he played this bishop f4 move. Okay. So he went for this line and uh, uh, Fabiano played very fast with this check on a5 without castle. Okay. Without castling and they came to endgame which looks like <coughs> Okay, it should be this normal. This is supposed yeah. to be a draw, yeah? Yeah, but they are still pushing, it seems, okay. yeah. <laughs> theoretical draw. Theoretical yeah, draw, it's supposed draw, to be yeah. descending as far as I know. And also this a3, h3 does not look like... <laughs> no, but he wants to push g4 yeah. at some stage. Yeah, yeah, this is... Okay, this is what he wants to do. He wants to disturb your bishop. You see? He's playing h5. Yeah, h5, okay. e6. Alright. Bishop f1, okay. Bishop f1 is a very deep move. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, he wants also to stop bishop e4 because knight uh -huh. d2 is not okay. hanging on g2. And a6, bishop g5, yeah, it seems... Okay, somehow I, I would never be worried here with black pieces. And it but how did white now do? 92 or what did he, what did he yeah. play? He played 92, okay. And some exchanges. Aha, uh -huh, okay, this is how they got so took. And yeah. uh, it does not seem that black has... Okay, still... No, but I think that's... Structure uh, is slightly better for white. Yeah, now. white is better. Because it, this b7 pawn is... Yeah, white uh, should be better, but white problem is that maybe he's... King is a bit far. Yeah, this is the final yeah, position. Okay, it does not change it so much, but uh, does it make sense for me here with Black to push move like e5? And then if you take to take bad by pawn and to bring King to e6, because okay, we have one open c file which I control, and a d file which you cannot penetrate. Yeah, and just King e6, Bishop yes. e6. Yeah. Because then how would you uh, improve? Yeah, yeah, and also I mean e4. I mean, okay, I you guess that's something. E4. But e4, just king e6. King yeah. e6. What is uh, such yeah, a big deal? Uh, yeah, it's. Uh, it does not seem that now he will make something, but. Uh, yeah, this looks very okay for black. Yeah, even if he just uh, he fix something with a5, it's nothing. Yeah. Yeah, b5, b4. Okay, you want to take this pawn oh, with yeah. uh, such a lousy king? He, you can never hope to win this rook ending. How? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It seems to just around equal. Yeah. Yeah, yeah this looks that's like a draw. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So this is probably going to be a draw. Yeah, also Adams okay. and Nakamura, it seems that they are... Last time we were checking, it was close to draw. I mean, it was close. Uh, it was not so uh, interesting position. We stopped here, actually, after G3, okay. bishop e6. And, uh, oh, okay, it was normal that knight f1, knight e3 yeah. will come. But uh, it seems that uh, Nakamura somehow pre pressed him. Because well, exactly... If how can he press him? H4, okay, I want to play bishop g2, knight, knight f1, knight f3. How can he press him? Well, some f5 and some f4 somehow uh -huh. came. Okay. okay, this does not look like better for for white. And no. It seems that he but needs uh, to be careful uh, here a little bit. Moment, but why Adams didn't play knight e3? Mm, it's uh, maybe hanging on g3 or not? How? No, it's not hanging. So 
Okay, you can push f4. I will take and I will take a pawn on d5. Uh, yeah. And I d5. Yes, and then we see. Okay, uh, look, I have lousy pawns, but uh, those are extra pawns. Mm, yeah, that's true. But uh, can you actually... After uh -huh, after queen d7, you will play knight b6 at least. So you feel yeah. some pain? Yes. Or, no? or after queen d7, I would play maybe move like queen f3. I don't know. Yeah, this... No, uh, look, I'm thinking that with bishop f3, I am not playing for a win with white. Yeah, yeah, this is true, yeah, yeah. So if with bishop f3 I'm not playing for a win, I should now not complain if we get some simplifications finishing as a draw. No, this is my yeah, yeah, logic. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I agree, because, okay, after knight d5, at least now, if there isn't something tactical, I mean... Yeah, but I don't see it. Maybe we are missing something, but... Uh, Maybe it's I, unpleasant I if I play what? simply bishop to b8. Bishop b8, aha. Uh -huh. Threatening rook d8 and queen d6 or queen f6 later on. Okay, maybe this is a problem. Okay, I can play move queen f3. But do I win with rook d8, yeah? Yeah, then you play rook d8. You would this is the problem. Yeah, you would get the pawn. I would take on b7, you would take on h4. Uh, white, is still, uh, white is still fighting. Two bishops, uh, yeah, yeah, there yeah. are problems. Okay, so Adam's gonna like it. All right, so bishop f3. f4, very fast. Rook d1, b5. Let's see, just maybe they played a couple of moves. Yeah, queen d3 happened. Yeah, but Adams is maybe having problems here. Yeah, he's trying to hold him, actually. Because it's position is passive. Yeah, uh, it's, uh, I, I don't like it, of course. I mean, it's, uh, it opens up a bit. And also, like, can just continue to push with well, a5. I this is what I'm here wondering. Uh, if you, uh, do I, uh, can I play move? Queen, queen c4, maybe? Uh, no, I'm just thinking, oh, I can't, because I would like to push g4, but I would like to push it in a clever way when you take, ah, when I take and the then bishop to have a knight on h2 three, yeah. already, but uh, it is not going to happen. I'm going <laughs> to be tempo too late. Yeah, yeah. And I cannot move the knight first because g3 is hanging. Of course. And also here it seems that this move, I think it looks normal, yeah? It's mm -hmm. uh, and now I just want to push here and it's... Yeah, uh, descending is not a draw. And it will be tough probably after queen d3. It's <laughs> ah, so Adams is having the problems. And, and okay, but this means if... Uh, if uh, That's some strange, because just a couple of moves ago it looked like such an uh, uh, innocent position. Yeah, yeah. And it now it looks like a real problem. Yeah, may maybe actually he made a mistake because he did not try to move knight f1, knight d3 immediately. With the bishop on d3 and later on to do this uh, uh, stuff. Well, h5, maybe he didn't need to push h4, I don't know. Because maybe this is the start of the problems. Why not to play move... Uh, Bishop g2, knight f1. I mean, you are not really mating me. Why do I need to react with h4? Mm, yeah, after bishop g2. Because as long as my, my pawn is on h2, you can push your uh, f5, f4. Who cares? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and okay, c6 if you want to play now. I don't know. But. Uh, no, you can't. No, 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 it doesn't make any sense. Sense, so sense. It doesn't yeah. make any sense. I would play rook c1 and. Uh, okay, knowing Naka, probably he wanted to push h4. I okay. Think. But uh, now, okay, so what, first of all, the question is, what about if I yeah, take on d5, yeah? Pawn, yeah? If I catch the pawn, now, okay, h3 can be, like, H intermediate. G. And now... Okay, maybe he wants, if you take hg, I will take bishop g3, you will take bishop f7, I will take queen d4, threatening mating two. Uh, no, no, but it's queen hanging. Four, queen no, d4, no. queen d4, take it, when? take it, now, take it. But queen g3? Ah, queen g3 first, sorry. So side. I need, okay, so I need first to take on uh, f2. You take on f7, I yeah, take on f2. Yeah, but what if I take hg, yeah? How? Hg, bishop g3, bishop f7, bishop f2. Check, uh-huh. Uh, yeah. Check. Check. King f2, f2. Check. what the... Uh, what is, what is, what's going on here? Mm, but I don't believe that after king f3. Is it mate with rook hg? <laughs> I don't know. King f3. This is king because rook king f3 look like, or oh, king f1. No, king f1 is, okay, maybe king f1, yeah. Because uh, if I put the knight on f3, I there guess he no will not mate, mate me. Yeah, yeah, there is no mate, uh, because they're only heavy pieces. Yeah, this is a... Uh, I don't know why did Adams do this. Yeah, bishop g2 was very normal move, I mean, and uh, h4. Yeah, And uh, maybe we can uh, actually move on, okay. wait for okay. uh, wait okay. for Adams, and Good. move on again to uh, yeah. Ma Maxim. Because this was maybe the the game which can be decided. Decided out of well, what's happening like now. Well, seems like something happened in the Maxim game. Ah, rook b7 actually happened. Rook b7 played, good. Queen c6. So I'm not oh. completely out of business. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> rook b7, good. Queen c6. Six. Okay, took, took. This is tempo, oh, it's yeah. It's a very interesting position. So Rajabov decides to give a piece because 
he's banking on his past form. Look. Yeah, this is take, six. Take, take, job of takes, because okay, a pawn is dangerous. Mm, yeah, and actually knight f4, rook b1 is coming. Uh, yes, or knight f, yeah. Yeah, because knight f4, rook b1, and now actually if I take here, yeah, bishop d7, knight c5, bishop d5, yep. I cannot take even c pawn. Yes. And then it can be some problem if I or have to. Or on knight f4 also, can I play move like rook b3 on knight f4? And if you take on this, ah, I can't. I take because my bishop is hanging. Okay, but still, after still. rook e3 is the qu yeah. big question. Uh, I mean, c d7, bishop d7, knight c5, rook, rook e3. I mean, no, with those pawns, it looks like if white survives, survives with the draw, he should uh, be it's very good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but here it's, uh, let's see. Ah, no, he took knight e4. Okay, but that means that probably Maxim uh, it is uh, not exactly going the way. Ah, uh -huh, but maybe okay. Maybe I can do some tactical things after. You, uh, but maybe even uh, maybe it's not working. I thought bishop f4 or bishop g5 because then I would uh, have this extra check. But you have knight b6 actually. It's uh, it's uh, too much. It's, uh, uh, moment, moment. Knight b6. You're probably correct. Yeah, and it seems that Rajabov is in actually in uh, excitement. He has just uh, Rajabov, yeah. Yeah, he has one and a half minute. Okay, but he has a very good position. Yeah, and it's easy to play. There is not so many uh, pieces on the board. Not so many yeah, pieces on the board. I mean, uh, this, uh, uh, if he doesn't blunder something in the next few moves, if he ends up, uh, ends, uh, let's say, rook can pass a pawn versus bishop and knight, okay, uh, white is fighting for the draw. Yeah, yeah. Because this a pawn <coughs> will probably cost a piece. Yeah, but also, also it means that yeah, he plays rook b3, so in the next uh, few minutes they will play many, okay. many moves, I guess. Okay, so now happen, actually yeah. for uh, Vashier it's a tough decision. Because he can take on d7 and smoke is going to clear. I mean, then who cares? Even if uh, Taimur is yeah. having uh, 30 seconds on the clock, uh, it's not so important. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If he wants to keep matter complicated, that means that, okay, he has to play with exchange down. Yeah. Uh, a tough call. I agree. I mean, now I was just thinking a little bit about uh, this uh, possibility that uh, actually maybe Maxim will play this position for. Uh, does he have? Does can he play actually like this, as the possible CD? Yes. Bishop d7 and maybe such a crazy move. Because uh -huh. I will give check and then I will force draw at least. At least maybe it's not draw. I mean, this is I the problem. But it should be no, draw. It should I be mean, uh, it should be draw. But it's it should, uh, be, should be draw. But though not. No, it should be draw. Yeah, because, because it's also it's is far. Yeah, yeah. Because maybe okay. this is better way to take. Mm -hmm. But anyway, maybe we should be five looks. Actually, ugly for white. <laughs> Rook b1, I mean, and. Uh, b bishop b5. If I. Okay. So I need to take on b5? No, but a b and. This you take a b, b and uh, this looks. Knight c3. Yeah, knight c3. And I'm fast, but you will sacrifice one I piece. Think I think uh, yeah, I will sacrifice, make I will have two versus one. Uh, yeah, yeah, it will be draw. Uh, I, I mean, whatever manage, piece stay on the piece. Yeah, okay, so probably it will be a draw this game. So that means that actually Adams Nakamura can turn out to be a crucial game. Let's check how is the Toki doing. Uh, uh, yeah, how yeah. far did they go there? Okay, Liquid seems to be. Uh, in deep. Okay, they did not play so much, but it so seems very. So Liquid doesn't like a moves like h5. What do you think? Would Naka push h5? Probably. Mm, yeah, <laughs> yeah. But also somehow uh, h6, uh, you know, in a sense, maybe. I would play some g6 sometimes, continuing yeah. with the h5. Maybe later if I need to I will, open the king. I would like h6, to I don't much like this pawn to appear on h4. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, h6, no, this is not uh, the idea. Yeah, yeah, and also it's uh, also this with rook b8, rook a5 somehow. Okay, he wants to actually. But what to is here my bishop. active plan for white? The top he maybe needs to double on c5, no? Okay, yeah, and play maybe knight before. I think that uh, rook c2 maybe. Yeah. Okay, I want to cover f2 and uh, I want to double to try yeah, to be flexible. Yeah, and even this on a2, yeah. this uh, knight, just yeah. to be safe yeah, at just some to point. Try to yeah, just to be flexible. But, uh, it seems to me that, okay, maybe I can move the queen and play bishop d7. Or simply, can I start with c5 at some point? Yeah, it okay, cannot because it's hanging. Yeah, it's hanging. Yeah, I need actually maybe. You can move maybe queen if you maybe want queen to. Maybe to d6 actually. No, but c5, knight c3 anyway, it will not uh, be the big deal. No, yeah. but also I have some tactics. You play queen d6, 
ninety four. Yeah, bishop d seven knight d six. Knight f six, rook b seven, knight c five. Five. Yeah, this is. Uh, Some uh, coffee house uh, jumping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Those <laughs> even after I manage all this, when you move rook back. It, to it, it, not, it doesn't. It doesn't look. <laughs> yeah. Like Still, it is not the end of the world. Yeah, but. Uh, Okay, maybe h6 was not obliged, actually. No. I mean, it's somehow too safe move. I mean, I like think uh, that this game is going to be a draw. Yeah, uh, maybe like we will not push. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I mean, I because, be draw somehow because already uh, if he wanted to push, he would not. Maybe yeah. he would start to do something here, because it seems that he started with bishop a6, mm -hmm. and uh, we were saying about rook a8 immediately forcing. Yeah. Seems that uh, this game probably will be drawn. Uh, let's check some other games there. Yeah. How are they doing on uh, lower boards? Yeah, we have this actually what Mamedjaro uh, and against Yeah, Mamedjaro against Bakro. I was there and actually they also played very sharp line. I mean, uh, Mamedjaro, Bakro, because they played the uh, bishop uh -huh. e2, bishop this is d4. Benoni, yeah. Yes. yeah, and then they went actually to Benoni structure. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, but uh, I was not so sure that he got so much because this is now classical yes. Benoni with this. The opponent is on h6, which is yeah. unusual, okay. And but uh, usually black plays their yeah. h5 at some point and yes. trying so to play knight h7, so it should not be castle. like big deal. So castle and okay, knight h5 immediately may be a little bit surprised because I think that usually people who are playing Benoni, they like to take this, to get rid of that bishop, yeah, yes. this bishop 3 first and then to think later on. What but maybe do. he didn't like it after bishop f3, bishop f3, that it's not so easy to develop. Harmoniously. But usually I can go, can I go 98, 97, yeah? You can go. Because I if uh, I, ah, maybe. If you play this such a kind of move, I would play, for example, move a5. And 97, of uh, course, what else? Then I would, in such a kind of positions, uh, Grigori choose to play rook a4. With the idea to push b4? Yes, at some moment b4, idea yeah. to prepare b4, and he was actually beating some people doing such a things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because somehow he he could not uh, he did not manage to put the knight on d seven on time. It seems. So what happened uh, in the game? So in the game, Bakro jumped. Knight h five, yes, and, and he went back. I mean, this is. Uh, so what he thinks he's playing a uh, Catalan when you're jumping knight h five, knight six. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Catalan. Maybe somebody yeah. should tell Bakro that he's uh, playing Benoni. Uh, yeah. Uh, Ninety-two. Two bishop, two queen. Okay, so now he got this classical business. Okay. Uh, but I'm not so sure. Why can't you exchange the right good. bishop? I I do not like this kind of positions for black. Yeah, so black is supposed to be better, yes. Because yeah, this looks... looks like. uh, but later on it seems that... Oh, again, this yeah, uh, Catalan stuff yeah. are happening. Yeah, <laughs> <possible>. <laughs> okay, three. Okay, jump. 95, yeah, it was It was just... It seems that... Uh, no, but Mamediaro should be better. He done uh, okay, what he yeah. could, yeah, it's... Uh, yes. And, yeah, this... Uh, Ah, he's now playing rook d8 in order to liberate knight, otherwise uh, you can... Yeah, and otherwise it would be, would okay. be tricky, yeah. And the six jump. Yeah, they came to something, oh. Okay, this is a pawn. Yeah, and also, I mean, this but knight this on c4 is... Uh, like like sure, sure. Okay, queen. Just this question, how much, yeah? Yeah, that's the question, how much? Okay. And maybe even large advantage. Well, this is interesting idea to exchange the rook on c8, not on e8, because okay. he was there. <laughs> so maybe with some idea at some point knight b6 and this guy. Will hang. Uh, but but okay, knight c1. I, I guess that it's not knight so. Green, it doesn't matter. I think they would come to the same. No, no. It's uh, it's just. Uh, it seems that. Uh, I think this is very large advantage. It, no, it seems that uh, Bakro is in big trouble. Yeah. yeah. I mean, even so now the square e6. Because uh, f5, maybe I go back to the rook to e1. If uh, your king opens. Uh, yeah, also, it's, it's questionable, what, what, what is the point after knight f4? Uh, knight f4... I mean, now knight e6 looks like uh, the end. I mean, knight e6 is serious jump and pawn swing also on g6. Uh, yeah, and after f e, when I can take with the queen, yeah? Yeah. And this looks... Uh, King is open. And knight is coming to e6, you have to play g5 in order to not yeah. lose another pawn, and okay, now it's at least knight e6 look good. This I mean, this looks like winning, yeah. It's, uh, no uh, moves, I mean... Uh, I think, uh, like French guys would say, uh, domination. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, sort of happening at this yeah. moment. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, yeah, night four happened actually. <laughs> Just okay. yeah. domination. <laughs> domination. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, okay. So, uh, so how is this match doing? Okay. So let's see what else. Yeah, is now Mamedjarov is very close to win. Yeah. Mamedjarov is very close, close to win. win. Yeah, uh, and so uh, actually this game between uh, Adams and Naka is going to become very important. 
Yeah. Because this is actually a game that seems like where uh, Italians can fight back. Yeah. The only, the only game, actually. The only because game. I, because I think that Washir already finished. This will be the Ah, Washir, it is exactly happening what we predicted. Yeah, yeah, this bishop c5. Yes, yeah, and exactly this is what we predicted, so all right. This should be draw. I this mean, is going to be a draw, uh, yes, yeah, that's correct. Just g5. I mean, yeah, how here to, it's, uh, how to maybe they will play a couple of moves uh, yeah, just because of the team tournament. And no, it uh, just finished. Ah, it just draw, finished. Yeah, yeah it, they just finished. Draw. Okay, this is finished. This yeah. Okay, so what is done? Uh, yeah, we have. Okay, Caruana Karyakin is also very close to draw. And, uh, and Safar Livokaturo, actually. Uh, we did not uh, check them no, until Safari? now. Yeah, it's, uh, it should be uh, just uh, it's tough to find him. Uh, so, ah, it's here. Vokaturo, Daniele, Safarli. Looks better for Safarli. I mean, yes. we can see just uh, what yes. they, ah, they played, uh, actually. It was just uh, B3. I mean, I don't believe in this move actually so much. Uh, I think for but, white. Uh, but your uh, compatriot is playing this for about uh, 25 years. Yeah, yeah, I know, but kind of uh, uh, yeah, but I don't think from this uh, exactly from this move uh, order. Same story. He plays d4. No, knight e4, d4, and then d5. No, no, but now I can play d6. Yeah. This yeah, but he didn't tricky. look. He yeah. didn't. He played knight e4, d4, d5, and you get this Grunfeld, which Predrag is playing 25 years. Yeah, yeah, look. but yeah, but d6. I think it's unpleasant because right. after d4, actually, I can play e5. And I think a D D bishop a three I can sacrifice the bishop on the exchange. Uh -huh. Okay. This is unpleasant. I'm okay. not so sure about this position. So this is why I said that uh, ah, so this can be interesting Grunfeld. idea. And, uh, and now let's, let's move to final but position let's because yeah, we yeah, don't have so much time. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, the final it. position. It looks slightly better for black. Yeah, black is uh, one pushing. Pushing. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, anyway, uh, more active rook, uh, better uh, structure. It is uh, difficult to imagine that black can never lose this. And white, yeah, white can lose this. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if he loses a pawn somewhere, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, even I. I'm not sure that uh, what is happening. Even if just rooks are not on because the board. Because what you here are gonna do? I mean, a4. You don't want to play obviously. If you play a4, I'm going to hit you rook h5 tempo and then play a5 myself. Yeah. And you are getting this typical Slav uh, pawn structure, which is better for black. That's true. Yeah. Okay. If you don't want to play a4, what do you play? Yeah, that okay, but uh, yeah, it's tough. Okay, I, I don't see other another move actually. I don't see another move because Rook C2. I mean, he, he, looks, he, looks he was he was on C1. Yeah. I mean, Rook C2 looks, looks <laughs> so very fast. Uh, no, but Rook C2 also Rook H5. I mean, yeah, at least you can uh, just force this H3. Yes, and yes, then yes, you can uh, do so whatever you want. Fighting for a win. Yeah. Okay, and what else is in this match? So we had this uh, first Topalov and uh, Leko, then Caruana. We said it's close. Yeah, Adams maybe, he, but he's suffering. It seems. Uh, Seems to me that he's suffering. Because okay, let's uh, get back to Adams. Because hmm. <coughs> ah, he managed to organize his rook to e5. Okay, this looks uh, like big achievement. I mean, okay, so bishop f3. Now let's go back to bishop f3. That's the moment when we left. Uh, 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 yeah, bishop, bishop f3, 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 f4. f4 actually, yeah. we left okay, here. Yeah. We left here. No, no, so actually, we left <laughs> here. Yes. Exactly. When we were rook saying c8. about queen c4, but rook c8, he played. King g2. Uh, maybe even trying this maybe G4, he was yeah, yeah, he was G4, was thinking yeah. about G4, yeah, and Bishop, Bishop E6. Bishop E6 stopping it, okay. Rook E1, Queen D7, then King G1. <laughs> trying to, okay, stopping Bishop H3. Yes. Check at some point. Well, looks... Uh, Bishop C7. Uh, Adam's suffering. Yeah. Uh, Bishop C7. But I'm not, I don't think that here is actually... If I manage to do knight f3, is it yes. so bad? Uh, because maybe, maybe I, I not, thought maybe you want to sacrifice him. Rook need to go somewhere. Okay, he needs some smart move with the queen. But uh, queen has to go somewhere intelligent. Okay, maybe on c6, but... Uh, okay, you go to c6. Uh, okay. Rook e1 or rook e2? Okay, rook e1 should be... I'm not allowed to do something crazy. Like I thought like about uh, knight f3. Uh, no, like uh, rook g5. Ah, rook g5, yeah, okay. And uh, bishop f5, I guess. Bishop f5, f5. now okay, queen. Or to do this, what to do with this queen? Because next move is maybe bishop uh, d8, yeah? No, bishop d8 I'm not afraid. Bishop d8 I want to take on f4. And to with give the queen, you exchange. Yeah. But the problem is that... Uh, There's I'm some queen c1 yes, also, I and fg3. And I don't see a clever square for a queen. Okay, so I can't do this. So I need to go with the rook back, probably then to e1 all the way. Yeah, but okay, I think they were here somehow. 
We're very close to the same position. Okay, Queen was on D7, uh, yeah. And now Queen is on C6. Queen is on C6, Queen is on C6 so but D1. it's... Uh, okay, but also knight B3, knight C5 can be ideal. It's maybe not so bad, I mean. Of course, white has to be careful, but... Uh, this knight, uh, I think this knight was go probably going to stay there. For a long time. And you might die on the other side of the board. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's see. Okay, Adams is fighting. Yeah, yeah, but maybe actually he improved the position uh, from the last time yeah, so. Because uh, this rook c8 was somehow too slow. I, I did not understand the idea. Uh, they are almost at the time control. Yep. Yeah, yeah but nine. yeah, yeah, I think there is no uh, any more problems with the, with the time. time. With the time, yeah. Okay, so, so how is. Uh, uh, so, okay, so Mondialo is probably going to win. How is uh, Caravana doing with uh, Teriakin? Okay, this is, yeah, we can just. Uh, because if, uh, if this is nothing, then it will be quite big. Ah, this is just draw. I'm not so yes. sure that uh, this that is can do it. Uh, and who else is playing in this match? Dominguez, yes? Is Dominguez? No, 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 no. This is different match. Just Adams we had, Rajabov who made the draw, Mamejarov who is winning, uh, Safarli who is cl clearly better. So just Topalov Leko stayed, but uh, How is not can just so we can check yeah, shortly. I think that Topalov is just improving all the time position. Yeah, Topalov is while position, while yeah. Leko is not doing so much because now even bishop h3 at some point will come. I mean, you cannot even move the queen so easily. Yeah, I think the Now it's starting to, to be to better. Might, might win this game. Because actually I have the plan, maybe h3, it's maybe too slow. h3, king h2, king g2, and then to play, I mean, here, something like this, yeah? It is maybe it's too slow, but even just like positional threat. If you manage to do such a kind of thing, then pawn on c6 would be very weak. And now also this g6 square, is, it looks like really weak. Mm -hmm. You can also, you know what you can try, for example, I can also, uh, I have sometimes very big tempo move on knight e2. Yeah, this yeah, is a, a and knight tempo. Tempo. Yeah, yeah, if knight comes to f4. But actually what he's doing after knight e2, exactly now here. Yeah, is this a uh, position that they have? Uh, no, no, yeah, yeah Topalo is thinking, but what no, about knight e2 knight here? Knight e2 is... Uh, Looks, uh, okay, if you take rook f4, this is the end after rook yes. I mean, it should be. No, I want to come with the knight to f4, bishop h3. And, and I, I think that bishop b7 is horrible also. No, bishop b7, I would make you. Bishop h3, knight f4. Can he play c5? Uh, c5, but uh, knight f4. Knight f4, yeah. You the cannot touch anything because... Yeah, cd, rook c7. Uh, no, cd, bishop h3, and I take a piece. Yeah, I at least has a yeah. couple of pieces. Yeah, I think to rook c7, i just six, everything, yeah. it's... Uh, no, yeah. this no, no this is bad position now for Leko because after 92, of course, if you if you are forced to play something like bishop b7, it will, it will be really bad, yeah? Yes, knight f4. Knight f4. With bishop h3, I think you are going to get mated. Yeah, it looks the end, actually. Yeah. It's very close to, to be really bad. No, but this is normally look how positions are, how games are lost. He had a decent game, and then for about five, six moves, he was a sitting duck, and now, okay, he <laughs> got this hopeless position. Yeah, yeah. This, is, <laughs> this is how this, uh, this game is going to end. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, well, so actually Naka is then the only chance uh, for them to fight back. This is the only to, game. Yeah, yeah. To, to win some game, yeah. To win some game, otherwise they're going to, it's going to be walk over. Yeah, but... Yeah, okay, let's, let's check the local club, this uh, Alkaloid. How are they doing? Yeah, okay. Uh, let's check. Uh, first of all, we'll check him on Chuk, I guess. Uh, because yes, uh, Chuki, is, Chuki always is always having some... Uh, ah, it's just draw. Okay. It's, uh, finished. Okay. I mean, what uh, what you were saying? You actually. Yeah. Then. Uh, uh, yeah. There is Tomaszewski on second board. Okay. Against Hari Krishna. Uh, wow. What's going on here? Moment. Uh, somebody would lose. A Look. Uh, either somebody would lose a piece. Or if nobody loses a piece here, then Black is doing very well. Yeah. Then <laughs> but I think uh, maybe Rook f5 looks forced for me. Uh, maybe maybe check and Rook d1. Moment. Rook f5. I push pawn. Yeah, no, I, I just said, I said just 96 and 96 okay, it's, and it's, it's uh, 94. Ah, 94, yeah, this is nice, yeah. I would so take, I cannot uh, take the pawn because... I would because, take uh, this yeah. uh, the way I like, not the way you like. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> no, actually, yeah, this is the problem. But... Uh, A moment, how does he stop it? Can uh, okay, he, stop he can it? he can give the check, I think, here. It's at least uh, I can give one check, yeah? Yeah. And play rook d1 and, mm -hmm. and for example, king, king f... Up. Rook D1. D1. But okay, now it's going to be dangerous. Even if I take on A6, I'm having uh, two runners. Yeah, How to fight with those guys? Hmm. Yeah, because anyway, 96 you are two pushing. Uh, yeah. Two passers, uh, 
This doesn't. So something is going to happen to you. Yeah, yeah. This looks uh, uh, not easy decision. And actually, they are not still. They did not pass the time control. Okay, so Hare Krishna is probably going to uh, win. What happened on a third <coughs> board? The third board is finished. Yes. Yeah, so third board is finished. It seems that uh, on third board that uh, let's see who won. Uh, Yakovenko, I think I that one. No, no. No, it, it was a draw. Yakovenko uh, Navara was the game, so yeah, yeah, it was draw. Yeah, it's Yakovenko okay. Navara. This was, uh, and, uh, as you said, it was a Greenfield draw. Who is draw. sitting there? Krivorochko uh, is sitting there, right? Uh, no, uh, no, 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 Andreykin. 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 Let's see his game. Just a sec to find him because. Uh, uh huh. Andreykin. How I cannot find him? Somehow it's. Uh, it's a bit confusing this lineup of the games. Okay, Lozinska. Oh, Andrik in it. Well, it's, it should be a draw. And yes. Bishop c6 just drawing then. Yes, because pawn structure is. Uh, okay, they will C6, just exchange uh, everything. Uh, Play rook d4, rook f4, I mean, uh, at least. Okay, f5. Okay. Uh, yeah, it looks. But. Okay, rook d6 was the last move. Okay, so if I take, yeah? Yeah, take f5. F5 immediately? Yes. But now I can play even bishop d4. Bishop yeah, d4 and this is and uh, this C5, is no yes. problem. Yeah, this I thought maybe rook b6, but I think that in this position, if I'm right, maybe I'm maybe I'm in wrong, can I play bishop d4 and just play and push f5, f5 and uh, just this should be like theoretical draw. draw? I think this should be theoretical Because draw. Because you, you, don't, you don't have any any break with the on the with the pawns. I mean f5 yes. and just after h4, h5. and. Uh, yeah. I'm keeping everything. This looks yeah, like... Yeah, because uh, the problem is in this pawn structure, when I play h4 and you played h5, I need my pawn on g3 to push g4 at some moment to win. And... To make a break. Yeah, and here, yeah. okay, I'm having those double pawns, so it, uh, I cannot make a break. Yeah. I cannot improve. And what happens in the other games of this match? Let's just go quickly through it and we can have a break, because yeah, I yeah. see that some people want to get out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> so I would not say who. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Yu Yang against Rachek uh, is uh, probably interesting. This was this Breyer, yeah? No, no, this was not Breyer, this was this uh, Sicilian. Uh, yeah, and this is like kind of Yeah, it's I no chance. Uh, Actually, once I won with uh, different uh, colors, I was white and I won, uh, I had white colors and I won similar position. With yeah. these pawns, I had this F2, F3 against... Uh, this should be probably a draw. But it's draw, but, yeah. but of not course. No white pieces. And uh, we have the Krivoruchko, uh, Shashkiran Krivoruchko. Actually, you were asking this, me yeah, yeah, I was asking because this was this, yeah. uh, this was not so good yeah, position Black for. Yeah, Black was doing Krivoruchko. good last time we saw it. And, and Black uh, is uh, still doing good. But maybe uh, they change a lot of pieces. Yeah. Good to be a draw. I mean. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it does not look that. Uh, so that means actually that uh, the crucial game on this match is uh, this Tomaszewski game. Yeah. This past pawn. If Tomaszewski Jeez. can manage to save this game, then it's uh, it could uh, be six draws. Yeah, it will be. Yeah, it's, it seems that, yeah. This is how it looks like. So let's just check only once more this Tomaszewski position. Maybe it's, yeah, because it's uh, time uh, it trouble. Seems and like now this, it's this game is going to decide. King f2, knight d3 happened, and knight c5 he will put. Maybe. Uh, but how do you put but knight c5? I play king e3. Yeah, let's knight see. Knight c5. Rook takes a6. Nice. And a queen, yeah? Yeah, yeah, 96, uh, d7 and just to... Ah, but maybe you can be smart. Maybe uh, you can first check me rook a3 instead. Does it matter? Maybe it doesn't matter. Rook a3, king e2. But, uh, yeah. Right? No, okay. Okay, and if I do check, it's nothing. You give check, check. I nothing. play knight d2. Yeah, but also, I mean, uh, yeah, 92, and I cannot do anything. Ah, knight b3, you, you heard. Knight b3. But what if I just... Uh, huh. Ah, then I would make a draw. No, because I thought that in this position, but okay, it's, uh, the problem is that probably it's hanging. I can play king d4, but uh, then you will take two pieces and put the rook on f6. And mm -hmm. This is also interesting, uh, because this position with rook on f6 might as well also be lost, because I would run with my king to your knight. And yeah, threaten yeah. At, at some stage to take a rook or to take the knight. Aha, uh -huh, but here is the problem actually, king d4, knight e6. He has a no repetition, uh -huh. king e4, knight c5. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, there are some chances actually to survive, but obviously uh, that uh, somehow Evgeny is fighting. Yes. It seems mm -hmm. that, uh, and let's, let's see, okay. maybe they played uh, one uh, somewhere. 40th move is actually now important. 
they lost they had lost like two moves. moves but something was played by Hare Krishna uh, and Tala played some move I think or no he's no no he didn't same to me because he was looking uh, on the side and so on okay this is uh, we are going to, to see after time control what will yeah. basically happen here I think yeah yeah now I think you, now it's time. Uh, yeah, 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 you have sure. to explain that uh, okay yeah <laughs> you're taking a short break yeah yeah we will take a short break Thanks a lot, yes, Ivan. And, uh, it, was, it was a long yes, uh, and conversation. Yes, and, uh, and for the viewers, I have a good news. I'm going to be replaced by Sandra, which is a better yes, view. Yes. And <laughs> I wish you to enjoy the rest of the time. Thank you, gentlemen. <laughs> back and Sandra you are with us again yes. after some maybe longer break yes. than okay. expected yeah <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we can see first of all uh, the key game in a uh, match against uh, uh, match between soccer and uh, pa uh, Objetivo Risarquimento from mm -hmm. Padova so let's see just game Mamidjarov, uh, Mamidjarov against uh, Bakro because it was uh, looking like everything is finished in this game so 
after night f4, f, uh, as Ivan said, domination on e6. <laughs> so, I mean, uh, what happened is knight f6, knight e6, and obviously that uh, black is in big trouble. I mean, mm -hmm. he is uh, pound down, and mm -hmm. uh, also on the other side, we don't see what he can do. Mm -hmm. I mean, where is his counter player, and so on. And so, f4 happened, f4, knight g4. Let's mm. see, e5, knight e5, knight e5, Good bishop e6. Mm -hmm. It seems very bad for black after mm -hmm. queen h7, queen h5. And uh, this is a position where, uh, okay, first of all, Mamajaro is white, which means mm -hmm. that uh, attack is always uh, <laughs> dangerous. And okay, Even black can take rook b2. Yeah. King h3, and it seems rook of summer, rook of eight. Yes. And it's my it seems the end, I mean, white or so I guess after rook b8, it's just the end after mm -hmm. rook f7, because mm -hmm. you cannot move the queen. There is a, mm -hmm. m I mean, even there is like, if you play queen e4, I mean, queen h6, maybe it's not immediately made, but it will be soon. Yeah, rook to <laughs> yes. 7 and the next move. Mm -hmm. So, actually, it seems that... Uh, yeah, because actually he cannot yeah. defend rook f7 mm -hmm. or rook f8. He cannot defend to... Mm -hmm of the squares and okay queen e4 also does not really bother white because mm -hmm. king h3 and uh, it's over. yeah it's hanging on h6 yeah. and uh, it seems to be the end mm -hmm. yeah it's uh, seems that this will be the the first decisive uh, mm -hmm. game in mm -hmm. this match yeah, because uh, until now we saw that uh, Vashir made a draw against mm -hmm. uh, uh, in a ma in game against Bakro and so on so uh, also uh, I think that now it's time we to check, uh, uh, to check section woman section because we are uh, here focused on some other games. Mm -hmm. and so on. We uh, I just want to see Gunina's game because uh, it seems that Gunina again lost the game, uh. which is really bad. Uh, and actually, I I'm not so sure why she played after knight db5. I mean, in, uh, why she played this uh, bishop before is mm -hmm. considered to be as variation at least where white has slight advantage. Mm -hmm and without any risk so i think that this was not good uh, decision today and okay it seems that uh, just this normal moves mm -hmm. this is like the theory but uh, it's a theory but here with the two bishops mm -hmm. and this weak pawn on d4, d4. yeah i mean black is generally without mm -hmm. counter play maybe she can try to jump around mm -hmm. with knight and trying to use the fact but that e3 is good yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Seems that uh, she did not manage even to do this, because this position looks mm -hmm. just clearly better for white. And uh, uh, maybe nice. This is nice move, C3, mm -hmm. because uh, uh, Bodnaruk decides uh, decides to change to change the position. Mm -hmm. I mean, there is uh, now Black doesn't have this strong, uh, weak pawn mm -hmm. on, on D4, D4 but, but two bishops mm -hmm. and open position. Bishops are they are working. working yeah, mm -hmm. I think it was actually quite easy game. Uh, and also, this is third uh, uh, loss in a row for yes, Gunina. Yes, Gunina is not in good shape, but... Uh, yeah, and somehow I... I she's tired. Uh, yeah, she's tired, know. but on the other side, she just chose the wrong opening. Mm -hmm. I mean, because if you want to avoid the uh, third loss and mm -hmm. you want to play on win, at least you should play something which is uh, uh, really uh, dangerous for mm -hmm. other side, not to give just uh, advantage like that mm -hmm. to your opponent. So I think that this is, uh, at the end, she just got mated, if I understood, uh, yeah. So, okay, okay nice, nice win, by nice yeah, yeah. yeah but uh, let's get back to the match on the first uh, table. Nona's so, and, uh, Nona uh, yeah, it seems that Bella won okay. the game. Ah, oh, Bella won the game. Yeah, Great. here we can see the graphic, uh -huh. yeah. The okay, Bella played against Pogonina, yeah, with and the she won the game. And Jignize, without uh, with like see. pieces, mm -hmm. yeah. We, ah, okay, at first we actually can we see. Yeah, we were seeing that this position was slightly worse for mm -hmm. black, and um, but in one moment, <laughs> yeah, we stopped actually here, mm -hmm. queen b2, and now a3 was played by Ogonina. This is not so. Uh, if white has to play this move, something mm -hmm. is wrong, yes. So maybe the best way was just to. Play queen c, uh, but ah, queen c3 cannot be played here. This is the problem because now rook on g4 was uh, on very bad position mm -hmm. because rook e1 and actually mm, black mm -hmm. is just a winning exchange and that's the that's mm -hmm. the problem. 
a3, okay, defending the pawn, but uh, I'm not so sure that uh, after rook a8, I mean, now if we look at the position of this rook on g3, I mean, it's not doing, uh, it's on g4, sorry, uh -huh. it's not doing anything, but next move is rook e1, and mm -hmm. rook g3, rook e1, everything seems to be forced, queen a1, and now, this is very nice, actually, this uh -huh. queen g1 move. Yes. Simply now, queen on c5, and uh, if uh, if you look at this bishop on a4, it's mm -hmm. really not doing anything, because yes. if you don't take on c6, I mean, it looks like trapped. Mm -hmm. and, and now it's threat for black uh, rook h3. Yeah, rook h3 is mm -hmm. a nice threat, yeah, of mm -hmm. course. This is the, the, the main move mm -hmm. here, and the main threat, king f3, but anyway, rook mm -hmm. h2, and... Uh, it seems very easy win for mm -hmm. uh, for Kotenashvili. Really actually, she yeah. at the end it was really nice mate with g5. Mm -hmm. So I mean, after rook e3, queen f2, okay, uh, Pogonina resigned, and mm -hmm. it seems that also this is second loss in a row for her. So it's uh, not really good. Yes, it's not really going good. So let's see the um, uh, another uh, Game games. Just to say, yeah, do do. Yavakashvili. Mm -hmm. Against Chukliyan. Ah, she won. Yeah, she won. So actually, mm -hmm. ah. Nona is winning match. Uh -huh. Yeah, the final position looks very nice. And uh, uh, yeah, we were just saying in the in the beginning that this position does not look mm -hmm. good for black. And exactly, e5, d5, this structure is, uh, is just bad. And mm -hmm. we can see here how she attacked with g4, g5. Mm -hmm. Queen on b7 is actually not doing so much. Uh, all the white pieces are on the right Her positions, mm -hmm. yeah, on the king's yeah. side, and uh, mm -hmm. obviously that uh, here mm -hmm. there was no chance for, for black, black to survive, yeah. Mm -hmm. V3 knight before, just trying to put the queen into the game, rookie 3. But and I guess that there was, yeah, I guess that there was some nice lines, like uh -huh. after knight city, I can pl just give you the rook, I mean, mm -hmm. rook g3, and I will just go on this side, I mean, just, uh, I guess, queen g4 or something mm -hmm. should be over, maybe even knight Four f7 pieces, is... Uh, uh, yeah, it looks. Uh, it looks. Uh, king. Uh, yeah. So, it's so I think that this was the idea of uh, uh, Leila, and now after knight mm -hmm. a one, I guess some. Yeah, queen g four winning G4. because even you cannot go rook c one. Mm -hmm. This is your problem. Usually you would try to get contraplay, but mm -hmm. actually rook is uh, <laughs> hanging, so you cannot get the contraplay mm -hmm. on this uh, first rank. And it seems that mm -hmm. if you attack with three pieces, I mean. Uh, uh, Black mm -hmm. is defending with the uh, bishop on his seven and pawn on g seven. Mm -hmm. Of so course, it's that totally uh, winning yeah, it yeah, yeah. So okay, rook c six mm -hmm. ha happened, but this was very, yeah, it was the end. Just knight of seven. Usually mm -hmm. in this kind of position, you, you always have winning mm -hmm. sacrifice. So this is what happened. Mm -hmm. A king of seven, rook g three, and okay, just the end is. Uh, <laughs> you, you cannot you cannot uh, avoid mate, and. So yeah. uh, Nona's team is uh, actually uh, winning, really? yeah, so mm -hmm. and it seems also that it's it, the three, three, they finished also the, the one more game, so and fourth board, yeah, so fourth board was uh, just draw, but and uh -huh. so uh, if I understood, yeah, just yeah. yes, okay, so just, but that's really draw, yeah, so mm -hmm. but let's see, let's see maybe the game of uh, Goryachkina. Mm -hmm. Because it seems that this is a finished as draw. We were speaking about this sacrifice, mm -hmm. uh, which is very interesting. And now after B, C, D, C, okay, Bishop E3 was very normal move. And mm -hmm. this is the compensation. I mean, uh, mm -hmm. you cannot uh, do so many things with white uh, mm -hmm. pieces. I mean, even it's, uh, uh, of course, black has to be careful mm -hmm. to not exchange all the pieces. And then you stay just with the uh, piece up with white, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and so on. But uh, I think just this pawns are really strong, I mean, at the end, mm -hmm. if you look at the position, it's actually white who has also to think a little mm -hmm. bit here how to, how to, to hold the position, mm -hmm. because obviously if you take e5 pawn, mm -hmm. for example, after rook e2, trying to exchange one rook, mm -hmm. then after rook e2, I, will, I would of course take, take and take on e5, and now with three pawns and with mm -hmm. this b4, c, c3 pawns, it's uh, probably a very, very hard position for Defenders. Yeah, for defending. Mm -hmm. And now rook e3, king g7, just positionally, I mean, with this rook on d2, if mm -hmm. you cannot move it, I mean, mm -hmm. because obviously that uh, such a move, like, uh, let's say, after king g7, you, you, you are not able even to play like mm -hmm. this, because rook b2. Mm -hmm. I mean, at least. So, it's not easy to play this position. With yeah, white because now, now white would uh, lose, lose the so game with mm -hmm. b3. 
So I think that uh, actually here just Black Polish was trying Kina maybe to play on win, but okay, King E1 and uh, this, should be, this should be this should be this should be. Okay, draw, I mean. let's check uh, Stefanova against. Uh, yeah, it seems mm. that this match will not be so easy Hust. for Gambit, because I mean they are favorites in this match. Oh. But okay, on second board you have the you have draw, and now you have on this uh, on first board that Stefanova. I think that she is fighting for a draw. Uh, Mm, I think she will reach it, but uh, okay, here it's... I want to play something like... Uh, 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 I thought something like uh, King, okay, King F3, F3 should and be the then Knight uh, H1, yeah, Knight this F2. Is yeah, yeah, this so is uh, actually uh, the direct threat. But you will play something like Bishop B3, maybe? Mm, yeah, the Bishop B3 is... The only way to... Okay. Not the only way, but uh, okay, now... Yeah, but now things are also mm, but maybe. This rook on g4 is. Okay, but after bishop b3, what's uh, what I can Knight do here? Knight f1 is. Knight f1 is a check on d1, yeah. I ah, think. okay, and uh, my pawn on e4, sorry. Yeah, yeah, but maybe uh, something like uh, uh, maybe knight e2, or for example, I thought maybe even to give this. Uh, this looks a little bit strange, but uh, yeah, just to give the G pound, mm -hmm. and then I try to push the C5. Mm -hmm. Although Bishop B3, and you will uh, mm -hmm. you will be on time, but maybe let's say Knight F2. No, mm -hmm. I'm actually forcing you to decide. I, I guess it's uh, why should not be even here. I mean mm -hmm. Knight F2, Knight D3, Knight F4. I mean White is playing on win, mm -hmm. so I guess that Bishop C2 would be a nice move in order to force like let's mm -hmm. say E5, Bishop B3, D6, and now mm -hmm. I mean. Black at least can make a draw like this, uh -huh, this okay, seven yes. and something like this mm -hmm. is interesting. But let's see, maybe they played some uh, some moves now. King f two, king e eight. Of course, king f three is I think it's forced. Simply, white does not have other options. Of mm -hmm. course, uh, white is trying to play on win here. Black okay. is uh, yeah. I so just want to check uh, other positions from this match. Yeah, let's see which uh, which games. We saw Goryachkina, uh, third table. Yeah, the Shing. third. Shing Yang, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, just to find. Uh, so, uh, yeah, lunch for <coughs> Tea. Uh, it seems that, yeah, <laughs> it seems that Tea is. Uh, Tea has a nice position, mm -hmm. I think. Uh, okay, 95, obviously, now that uh, every endgame would be just. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, worse for black because yeah, of this b6. Like yeah, th this would be the only chance mm -hmm. for black yeah, to try to hold the position. Mm -hmm. Eventually, maybe rook e4 I can play here, for example. Uh -huh. And uh, although there is nice trick, maybe after rook e4 I can play bishop c6 with black pieces and rook d4 b4. This can be a tricky idea. And now after a b a b, I'm not uh, able to take on b4. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can, but uh, of course it's uh, leading to lost uh, mm -hmm. endgame. And on the other side, it's not so easy to stop b3, b2. Yes. I mean, obviously, that white can play rook f4 and he will, mm -hmm. or she, she will stop it, but... Uh, but okay, it's... Maybe uh, it's, yeah, maybe I, I thought somehow, yeah, actually this had happened, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so, b5. Okay, white is, of course, not in danger mm -hmm. here, but uh, it's uh, also questionable whether uh, sh uh, whether uh, Tia can win game or not. Okay. Maybe c5. Maybe c5 in this position. c5? Uh, yeah, maybe we something like this. Mm -hmm. uh, with the idea, I'm after bishop c6. To 97. Play knight oh, mm -hmm. But rook e8, rook e5, I have this idea. And mm -hmm. then knight c6 will actually Again, defend uh, you. Uh -huh. <laughs> so this can be <coughs> possible mm. uh, possible idea for white in case she wants to play on win. Mm. Uh, yeah, I like actually c5 move because uh, it's first of all, it's the only mm -hmm. chance to play on win and knight on d5 is active. I don't know what is happening if I take here because somehow this end game, I mean, it's uh, after bishop g4, not just that I can take a g4 and play rook c1, but this will be very close to draw. I mean, uh, maybe not. Maybe not actually. a g4, rook d5, rook c1. Ah, but uh, black can play before mm -hmm. because uh, after rook d8, I would uh, actually try to, mm -hmm. to uh, go, go with, with the king. king. Mm -hmm. But actually, our b4 is just forcing here. Mm -hmm. uh, draw a b4, a b4, and after c6, losing one tempo, rook d8, mm -hmm. and okay, rook c8, and uh, 
when we exchange everything, it will be draw. <laughs> but uh, c5 should be the best option for white. And okay, they are while playing we one more game, yeah? waiting here, uh, yes, but I just wanted to check Jagnice against Ushenina because we mm -hmm. didn't check that game for some time. <coughs> okay. Uh -huh. Gnizil Shenina, yeah, it's mm -hmm. this is of course technically the winning. it's winning position mm -hmm. of course and uh, it means that yeah that uh, mm, no uh, will uh, win this match with yeah, no, no, but no no will three and half half mm -hmm. this is uh, this is a really big win and I think uh, with this win they secured uh, the first place the first pla mm -hmm. uh, first place I don't know who who can be there who okay. th is there any strong team still left. Uh, for because no, okay, I think no. Because if we uh, can say, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think that the Stukin can uh, mm -hmm. surprise them. Mm -hmm. uh, although maybe they played already, I, I'm not so sure. I, I, I guess think not. Not, no. not, no. So yeah, it seems yeah that uh, Nana is waiting mm -hmm. for the, yeah. Okay, we can go for a little to see open section. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see a little <laughs> bit open section and. Uh, because let's see what happened first of all. In uh, we have also to see this uh, uh, second table. We can see that uh, Lichia won game, mm -hmm. and uh, and Kranik? No, no. Uh, yeah, and this is uh, actually bad news mm -hmm. for the uh, for the Medni Usadnik uh, because th this is one zero for Siberia mm -hmm. and for Kramnik's team. And let's see just what happened. Uh, okay, they were playing. This, they were playing Ragos in defense. Mm -hmm. Basically, this is one of the top level lines. Mm -hmm. It is considered to be actually uh, very close to equal. But let's see. Uh, I think uh, that uh, Li Chao actually prepared this. Uh, uh, just slight. Yeah, he was actually claiming slightly better endgame here. Mm -hmm. and, uh, somehow. She was said. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's you know, on this highest level, you can always, mm -hmm. if you get this kind of uh, of positions, mm -hmm. it's good because you can play without risk and mm -hmm. so on. And, and exactly what happened. Slow. Yeah, and also, I mean, Li Chao. Yeah. I mean, he he has uh, now he now he's with like uh, two thousand seven hundred fifty, mm -hmm. and uh, really, I mean, uh, uh, they have this uh, national team of China mm -hmm. is extremely strong. I mean, if you take now, I mean. I remember a few years ago, Wang Yu and Wang Hao were like main players in uh, mm -hmm. in China. I mean, and now you have uh, Ding Li Ren, Wei Ji. Uh -huh. I mean, and uh, Li Chao. And okay, of course there are also uh, Wang Yu and Wang Hao still, mm -hmm. but uh, I mean, just improving all the time now. I think that he, they have like uh, seven eight players uh, over seven uh, or two thousand seven hundred, and uh, it's uh, mm -hmm. so. Just let's see uh, what happened in mm -hmm. this end game. Uh, it's tough for Black. I mean, with these bishops on d7 and, and d8. The pawn on b5 is yeah, yeah, and also what to do with the what to do with the with the pieces. I mean, b4 rook c8, rook d1, rook c7. However, it seems that uh, Black should be able to hold it because somehow also White has the problems with first rank, but if it it. Ah, yeah. When you lose b7 pawn, this means the end. So, <laughs> I guess that here, just uh, yeah, rook a5, mm -hmm. and black it does not do look anything. that black should uh, hold this yeah, position. Yeah. This position. Yeah, yeah. It looks tough. So, okay. Th I think this is very just important uh, win uh -huh. at the end. Okay, he resigned, but okay. uh, it seems to be very important win for uh, Siberia because on the last board they had this quick draw mm -hmm. uh, in game uh, Korobov against uh, Fedosev. So now let's, let's check see. Uh, Svidler Kramnik. Uh huh. This is, uh, of course, uh, always mm -hmm. uh, interesting. Interesting, and, uh, yes. Wow. Svidler is pawned down. Something wrong happened in the. Because <laughs> we were Me saying too. about this position, we should do to C5. Mm. It's very, it's very strange. That I mean, okay, this is where uh, everything looks about mm -hmm. uh, equal, and uh, this end game should not be worse for white. This is for sure, and I don't know how he managed to lose he the pawn. Yeah, something yeah. Maybe. Ah, rook c8 was, and uh, I guess that uh, his problem mm -hmm. is that after bishop d2, 
Now I guess that I can play bishop. Bishop. Oh. I can play bishop b2. Uh -huh. And now rook c8, knight c8, and white is losing the pawn. Yes. So I don't see the way to protect it, actually. And uh, bishop c6, bishop c6, bishop f6, bishop d5. Yeah, rook c8, knight c8, and now this knight is completely out mm -hmm. of the game. I mean, it's a tough, uh, tough position for, for a white. For a long yeah. time, huh? Yeah, because even when you, you need to, if you want to do something with this knight, you need to mm -hmm. put the king on c3. Mm -hmm. I mean, otherwise you cannot just develop it. And, okay, and, or, or just to push f3, e4. Mm -hmm. So let's see what happened. f6, bishop c5, king f7, all these moves are looking normal. Mm -hmm. And yeah, now he actually was prepared to push after king, after king e3, actually bishop f3 is possible. So now with this f3, actually Maybe move, F3 you cannot move. Is, uh -huh, okay. Anyway, I mean, if you let if you let black to do something here uh -huh. like f5, g5, if you, mm -hmm. if you don't threat uh, e4, it mm -hmm. will be tough. Okay, maybe white could play king d2, but also mm -hmm. you have to now take care about king f5, mm -hmm. for example. Yes. And now I, after h3, I have enough time after mm -hmm. king e4, king e2, maybe like this move. Mm -hmm. Now c pawn becomes very fast also. So you ha you have always to think about mm -hmm. king, which is okay. will come. Uh, King side, so f3, f5, f3. but now it seems that, uh, and actually Kramnik was doing very nice job because he waited with pawn on a7. Because we can see actually that uh, bishop on c5 mm -hmm. is also limiting the knight on c8. Mm -hmm. Yes. If but the pawn uh, would be on a6, then uh, maybe black would not be uh -huh. able to improve his position. But, but now knight b6 slowly. B6? Yeah, now he is improving slowly, h5. Let's see how it was, yeah. He gave the pawn and he took, uh, yeah, took it uh, back uh, later on, yeah. Yeah, and now, okay, advantage. and finally it was time for e4 mm -hmm. because otherwise the game is lost. Mm -hmm. e4, bishop e4, knight b3. Not Although pleasant, not pleasant position mm -hmm. for for uh, Svidler. It seems that this uh, light is uh, very good. Yeah, for uh, I mean that, uh, For Kramnik <laughs> and uh, that players are not uh, playing so well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> with this lamp, yeah? Yes. Because uh, it seems that Kramnik will have two out of two, and I mean, mm -hmm. yesterday he beat Nepomniachtchi, today, uh, mm -hmm. uh, today he's uh, very close to win against uh, Swidler, so uh, for now, Kramnik has a uh, <laughs> perfect score, yeah? <laughs> lamp and perfect score. Uh, yeah, yeah, good lamp and perfect <laughs> score, yeah. And, okay, uh, let's see maybe mm, also what is happening in the game of... Uh, Aronian and Dominguez because yeah Dominguez is actually pressuring here. Mm -hmm. Position should be about draw, but uh, let's see what happened after Queen e4, Queen d5. Left. Here Rook d1 actually Dominguez uh, played the Bishop e7. I was uh, recommending he here play, Bishop b4, uh, but uh, somehow yeah Knight c3, Queen f5. I thought that some d5 should be the move here, mm -hmm. but it seems that after d5 problem for White is that b4. Uh, b4 yeah mm -hmm. it's a counter attack and mm -hmm. now it seems that uh, he will simply lose the pawn mm -hmm. so d5 is d5 it's is not, not possible then at this moment yeah this uh, this is just pleasant position for mm -hmm. uh, black of course white is not uh, worse but somehow it happens that uh, Aronian was waiting around and mm -hmm. leaving uh, and giving this c5 very strange decision he I mean. wanted to play probably something like Knight. Okay, b4 is the idea. But okay, I know. For for mm. black and it's mm -hmm. uh, yeah, but knight f2 c5. I mean, yeah, it was not the best day for Aronian. Mm. This is for sure. This position, I mean, then you are suffering in this position mm -hmm. for a long time. Maybe the last <coughs> position is actually. You know, uh, let's see what is happening. <coughs> uh, it's tough to break mm -hmm. this position, but uh, obviously that uh, black is better. He can just play. Few First moves like just King G7, G7 for example. Like white yeah, it's it's not so uh, easy to recommend. Mm -hmm. yeah, I recommend anything for White. Mm -hmm. I mean, because he needs somehow to stay mm -hmm. uh, like uh, in this position. And also, I mean, Queen C4 is it's always some threat some with Bishop moment. D4. Mm -hmm. you, ha you need always to have this Queen D3 move. Mm -hmm. It doesn't Maybe look uh, so pleasant. So what they made a draw? Yeah. That's strange. Let's see the. Uh, <laughs> Fiddler and the Kramnik, no? They played very fast somehow. I don't think, I think that Kramnik won the game. Uh, this is for Kramnik sure, Kramnik won the game after 92, 93. Yes, because... Uh, but they were, they were, uh, they were uh, talking very 
very friendly. So, no, 93 draw. Uh, that cannot be. Something is wrong there. Mm -hmm. true. Yeah, black one. Black one, like oh, back okay. knee, because it's completely winning, of course. So next move would be knight f5. Yeah, as we said, lamp is working. <laughs> yeah, so knight b3, king d5. Okay, the position was uh, position was just uh, mm. just yeah. lost. So I mean, this is very good uh, news for the Siberia because now they are losing uh, uh, two and half to half, if I see well, and uh, uh, Dominguez is only chance for. Uh, Bad new Sadnik and uh, let's see just uh, also right. with Yugo Grishchuk mm -hmm. maybe just to see to, to try to conclude what will happen in this match. Uh, uh, just uh, let's see yeah with Yugo Grishchuk and uh, of course Rothstein Bang Yu, this is two important games now. Let's see. So with Yugo mm -hmm. Grishchuk first of all it was draw. Mm -hmm. So they already finished and uh, let's see then final game Rothstein against Wang Yu. Oh, he's defending uh, worse position, so this will be very, very uh, big win for, uh, for yeah, for Siberia, Siberia because I think that Wang Yu cannot lose this position, and they are leading three one mm -hmm. already. So, I mean, no matter what happens with, uh, with in the game in uh, Aronian, Aronian. Uh -huh. yeah, it, uh, yeah, yeah, Rostin is now walking to see the position, but okay, it's quite clear that they lost the match. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, this match looks like clear and uh, maybe before we uh, switch back maybe to to women's section just to see this uh, three, two, two other matches with uh, mm -hmm. between we teams with see. maximum points. So let's see just uh, if something uh, is finished on the, yeah, on, the uh, in, on the first board. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see Topalov. Yeah, Topalov, uh -huh. it seems that Topalov is winning the game. He's pawn, uh, pawn up. Uh, yeah, we stopped here uh, exactly when uh, Ivan was here. Mm -hmm. We were speaking about Moon 92 and, and we did not find seven, yes. anything. Yeah, and uh, exactly. Yeah. Bishop A3 actually was played by Leko. We said mm -hmm. this C5, 94 mm -hmm. is just uh, the end. And, and Bishop uh, H3 or? Yeah, or knight d5 maybe or maybe whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's it's simply looking lost. Mm -hmm. Bishop a3 was played by Leko, but now you have this rook b6. Now white has everything. He has better king. Mm -hmm. He has better structure. Uh, it was really bad uh, bad game after he had very good position. I mean, mm -hmm. out of the opening without any concerns uh, to do something like this. King h7, knight d5, rook e8, the queen queen e8. Yeah, technically winning position mm -hmm. for Topalo, but. Uh, Let's wait a little bit because uh, Topalo had this completely winning position in first round against against, against the Cartoon and Mika, uh -huh. and it was uh, I mean almost he he drew the, that mm -hmm. that position, but it seems that uh, Sokar is uh, uh, has uh, has very good chances to win today. Uh, let's see uh, another this Caravana and Karyakin or Karyakin and Caravana exactly they they finished the game. It was uh, finished as draw. And then we have Vashir, Vashir was finishing the game and uh, he already finished. And then we have Adams against Hikaru Nakamura. Yeah, Adams mm -hmm. is also, uh, yeah, this is actually a chance for uh, for Italian team. Adams is fighting for a draw. I'm not so sure, but uh, I think what that he, think, uh, I think he is able to hold the mm -hmm. draw because king on h6 is actually quite mm -hmm. bad piece. You cannot move this uh, king anywhere if you play. You just can play uh, something like, like rook d7 and. Uh, yeah, it, I think it, it will be draw very easily uh -huh. I mean in yes. the next couple of moves because I simply cannot see the the way how to Nakamura will improve, improve his position. Because position. Uh, the only chance is sometimes that you push g5, but, but simply rook a6, yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, this is uh, just uh, now it's mm -hmm. equal number of pounds, and yes. of course it's uh, draw, but. Uh, what else? I mean, okay, he played rook e4, but it's quite clear that next move is rook d7. Mm -hmm. and, uh, okay, what he what he's ah, trying to do? Rook he e5, and yeah, maybe then to. Yeah, but this is even draw. G5, but uh, it's draw. This is just all. No, no, it's always uh, it very looks close like to draw it's because draw. I can it's even very just. Very easy, I think, for white. I can play king h3 actually mm -hmm. and immediately make a draw. Uh huh. Yeah, it's. Uh, so on and uh, yeah, this is uh, mm -hmm. 
uh, just very close to draw. Okay, let's check uh, position Nana Why? and Dushan. Uh, yeah, I think that... Uh, we can see. Yeah, let's just switch back, switch uh, back to... Yeah, this uh, is just... Okay. Uh, G it's the end. Uh, it's H4, H5, King B6, and okay, mm -hmm. it's time for Shanina to resign game. Mm -hmm. I guess she will not play until mate. And she got <coughs> what do you think? Because she played so many moves. I mean, we, we were here, I we were checking this position. She will Sorry. resign now. Yeah, because we were checking this position mm -hmm. with King on B3. I mean, it was, okay, of course, it's okay. completely. Okay, yeah, she now she resigned, resigned and uh, yeah, this is three and a half. Uh, to half, Anna. it's. Uh, mm -hmm. Not something would you would uh, expect, yeah? We, I didn't expect that. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Very nice win, very mm -hmm. nice win, and uh, it seems that uh, Nona is uh, really already champion. Yes, yeah. <laughs> because <laughs> I mean, uh, I don't see yeah, who will stop them with this. But uh, uh, Nona's team played against uh, two or three very strong teams also, and won. Yeah, they won okay. against Aseko Gambi, yes. they won against Tugra, they mm -hmm. won against uh, uh, another team, another uh, Russian team, I cannot remember we, uh, what is the name now exactly, but uh, they won all Square, important yes. matches yeah, against Legacy mm -hmm. Square, yeah, they, so I don't see the way how, who can stop them, mm -hmm. I don't see the, uh, the team. So let's, uh, let's a little bit switch back to the mm -hmm. open section, just uh, to continue with the uh, to see, for example, yeah, Mamejaro won the game as mm -hmm. we were expecting it. Uh, it so Mamejaro, yeah, just we, we were here with we Queen H5 and then two moves mm -hmm. were played: just Bishop mm -hmm. B2, Rook F7, Queen E4, King H3. Of course, I mean, <coughs> just uh, Bishop C1, Knight F4, and okay, mm -hmm. just next move will be Queen H6. Of course, uh, uh, Bakro did not want to play anymore. <laughs> Simply after Bishop F4, I mean. Uh, White has in enough time even to take rook back. F4? Yeah, to take rook mm -hmm. f4 and just next move queen h6. But uh, okay, after bishop f4, maybe I have also something better or just I have to play like this because I thought that after rook f4, okay, yeah, it's just completely winning, of course, after queen e7. But uh, I wanted to do something. Yeah, queen e7, the problem is even at, uh, yeah, queen h6, queen h7. It just this endgame should be lost. So. Do I miss something? Why not knight f4, bishop f4? I mean, at least to try to fight for mm -hmm. uh, till the end. I mean, is there something wrong? Uh, maybe something. Because okay. obviously, ah, uh, this I thought no. no, no but queen the g4 queen g4 is with rook g8. g8. Yes, I thought yeah, that this is working. Yeah, so now uh, rook f4, queen e7. Yeah, it's uh, okay. Rook however. F7, it's, yes. uh, Okay, rook f7, queen, queen e3, can I hold it? No, queen e3, it's uh, queen g5 queen I can play. Six, but okay. I can play queen g5, but uh, ob obviously mm -hmm. that uh, it was... I can take on uh, h6. Yeah, I think it was just enough for uh, for uh, Bakro. I can Actually, take and, uh, yeah, this is this is easy win, sorry. Uh, I, uh, sometimes I need some, <laughs> I need a little bit. I don't even Check. have to. Okay, I can play. Uh, Queen f6. In the no, no. Oh, sorry. No, Bishop f6 maybe on uh, on uh, Queen h7. Rook f6. Rook f6. Sorry. Yeah, but this is also just okay, uh, Rook f7 and uh, taking all the pawns. Okay. I just in the end. Okay. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, so it's a uh, big win, and uh, now we have this. Uh, let's see what uh, what is happening because. Uh, on the on the last board, Safarli is uh, actually he he had a very good position. I mean, and uh, let's see if he uh, ah he already made a draw because mm -hmm. uh, when he, uh, when anyone was here, we were considering that after rook okay, five it will be tough. H four, okay, H four. But yeah, he did uh, not. A4. But he did not hear us. He did not play a five, mm -hmm. so he played knight c five, and later on rook g four. Okay, it seems that knight d4 was maybe uh, blundered by by uh, Safarli because now okay knight b3 is fourth. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I mean rook endgame side is just uh, drawish, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, the problem is uh, the problem rook is g7 that uh, yeah rook g7 mm -hmm. and just it's, uh, knight b6 knight and knight b7 seven and it seems that uh, white is holding it. Although mm -hmm. I, I do not think that. Uh, that uh, Safarli was so uh, into mood to press till the end this mm -hmm, position. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it was not. S I think it was not so important now because uh, 
uh, they already had one big uh, plus and we mm -hmm. can see now that also on a sec uh, yeah we know that uh, actually it's two and a half and one and a half to s uh, for soccer and uh, Topalo has winning position Adams will probably make a draw and it should be safe win for uh, soccer in this uh, moment. Adams uh, Nakamura game for uh, yeah uh, Adams Nakamura yeah yes I think yeah King of Three and just ah, okay. Uh, but let's uh, let's uh, so check maybe Aronian. Yeah, Aronian. Mm -hmm. It seems that uh, yeah, okay. It's uh, still something uh, did not happen too much. But okay, if this queen appears to d5, mm -hmm. it will be a big problem. And uh, okay, Aronian is. Uh, it seems that he will uh, that he will be in uh, problems. Yeah, but. Uh, it's not easy to play this position with white. Not, not, no. It's you just uh, need to suffer mm -hmm. all the time. Yes, to suffer. And, uh, okay, the, the thing is that, the uh, very, very good thing is that they already won the match. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, I mean, Wang Yu will not lose this mm -hmm. position. I mean, uh, practically they won the match, maybe. maybe so maybe they need some more moves. But I'm not sure that actually Dominguez will win this position. Somehow, you know, White has just one weakness mm -hmm. on d4, and he's actually defending it. If you don't find mm -hmm. second weakness, I mean, it will not, uh, it will not be enough. And this knight from uh, on Petri yeah. Square is. Uh, now I would like to see actually the the game of uh, to see maybe the match of Alkaloid. Let's see what happened mm -hmm. there. The uh, key game is actually to see if I if I'm right. Uh, yeah, five. so five draws, yeah, yeah. So we have five draws even there. But uh, who else is playing then? You. Ah. <laughs> who is playing? I did not hear. Hari Krishna Tomaszewski mm -hmm. made the draw, and so it's uh, maybe even finished. Yeah. Ah, Juhraczek. Yeah. Juhraczek. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, let's see this game. I think uh, Hraczek was staying well there. I remember the, yeah, 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 this was the position where uh, it was not something that, uh, mm -hmm. hmm, yeah, a lot of things uh, happens, but um, I do not believe that uh, Yu Yangi can do anything here. Mm -hmm. uh, simply, okay, A3 will, should not be enough, mm -hmm. I mean, in this, uh, this particular case uh, for, to, to win the game, I mean, because, uh, I guess that uh, I cannot push him on a3 in this mm -hmm. position. Queen e6 is it's maybe the option, but uh, may I play like this? Yes, take. Queen e6, queen e6, f6. You check. will give check, rook f6. King. Ah, but you have rook f3 back mm -hmm. and uh, uh, nothing big. Of, okay, or white maybe still. it's better to play uh, rook h6. With? Uh, with? Idea after a3, you want to give check or? Yes, and to go to a7. Yeah, but you can also do it maybe from here, yeah? Ah, okay. <laughs> because you get one tempo. Yes, yes, and, uh, okay. I but just it want seems to say. To me that, okay, here. Okay, for a2, g4, white should be enough fast I mean, with this pushing the pounds. Although, yes, I mean, okay, you yeah. also have to take care about some tricks like if you start with a king, I mean, not just uh, that it's mm. hanging the pawn on h2. But ah, you have to take check, care yes. about rook okay. before check, mm -hmm. so I'm not so sure actually. Okay. Is it really why it's so fast? Or because I mean g4. If I play king d6, king g3. So oh g5. Okay, I don't know. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Let's uh, now check uh, m some matches which are maybe not. Uh, uh, actually, they were not like big. Uh, uh, big derbies today, mm -hmm. but uh, let's see what small teams can do against uh, <laughs> big teams. So now, if I see well, my team from Norway is doing two and a half, two and a half yeah. for now against the uh, University Belorechensk. So first of all, let's see the results. Uh, I s I think that uh, Romano made a draw. Uh, this is exactly what I saw. He held the position with black pieces against Gelfand, which is I mean amazing. Mm -hmm. So let's just check the game. Uh, yeah, it seems that uh, yeah we were see we were speaking about this position that 
it maybe it's too solid for like maybe it can be slightly worse but not something big and it seems that uh, in this position uh, Romanov was actually able to hold and yeah it's uh, it seems that uh, white is slightly better but maybe it's not possible maybe to not do anything enough. <laughs> so yeah the, uh, and uh, let's see who won mm -hmm. from Valerenga because I guess that uh, uh, I would be surprised if there are uh, all uh, uh, results uh, uh, so I cannot see from here but uh, somebody uh, should won uh, I guess that uh, let's yes. second Rublevsky Christiansen yeah mm -hmm. well then I will be proud this is youngster from our team let's see his game Rublevsky against Christiansen 0-1 bravo Bro. Johan <coughs> so, yeah <coughs> e4 e6 d4 d5 92. Yeah, uh, I think that Johan already played this line. Mm -hmm. So actually, yeah, yeah, very nice, uh, very nice game because this bishop e7 actually I played a couple of times by myself, mm -hmm. and I think that is the best uh, answer mm -hmm. when you are playing because usually uh, the main line it goes like a6, mm -hmm. and then after let's say rook e1 or mm -hmm. something you go queen c7, mm -hmm. and uh, in many cases like after bishop b3. Like sometimes plays bishop d7 and long castle, but this is like too risky. Mm -hmm. So, so you think okay, Christiansen uh, opted for bishop e7. Mm -hmm. B3 is. Uh, I don't uh, think that this move is actually uh, the best option here mm -hmm. for uh, White. I think the better move is c3. And I had played two games. I mean, uh, even uh, two years ago, I was playing here uh, a game against. Uh, uh, current uh, world, uh, Carl Jr. world champion mm -hmm. uh, and it was finished as uh, draw. draw, so, okay, b3, castle, bishop b2 and queen f4, this is very good move, mm -hmm. the main idea actually of white is to after queen c7 to play move queen f3 mm -hmm. and at some point this queen, if this queen comes to h3 and bishop on d3, mm -hmm. I mean as the I possible idea, then it will be very dangerous with some pressure or on h7, yeah. Like because mm -hmm. two two bishops are everything is mm -hmm. working and here, and now Queen f4 has the idea actually that mm -hmm. after you play g3, then mm -hmm. you go back then Queen c7, and, and, and now you cannot play Queen f3, Queen, g mm -hmm. queen h3. This is okay. the idea, and g3 is also weakness because mm -hmm. when you put the bishop on b7, all of a sudden mm -hmm. there will be problems and with the white uh, bishop. Is on yeah. C4 for now. So let's see, Queen e2, Bishop c5, Rook a d1. Ah, beautiful move e5. Yeah. So knight f3, <laughs> e3, yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, knight e5, bishop b6, mm -hmm. rook d6, knight e8. Okay, this was some complications, but I'm not... Uh, yeah, I, I know Johann Sebastian, so he's quite good and uh, actually when it comes to the tactics, so it seems that uh, mm -hmm. Rublevsky maybe today overlooked something, yeah. Queen b7, rook e8. Wow, this looks very nice. And now, okay, obviously that here he had to mm -hmm. do this. Uh, and okay, this is practically tough position and the hard mm -hmm. position to say with white pieces. But okay, anyway, yeah, h5. Not just that the problem is that uh, with, the, with the g3 uh -huh, now, okay. the king is really weak and bishop mm -hmm. is active and so on. So this is, uh, yeah, so now rook d3. Okay, okay, this was... G three. Yeah, mm -hmm. this was the basically over here, c5, queen d4, mm -hmm. nice move, I guess just for the spectators, mm -hmm. the CB, Rook G3 and mate yes. on H4, I mean, King this King is H4. the idea, yeah. Mm -hmm. So Queen C2, Bishop C5 and okay, few moves later. Uh, the main problem also for uh, Sergei was that Rook D1 is met with Queen F2. Mm -hmm. Beautiful idea and then Queen and F2, Rook Bishop D1. F2 and finally mm -hmm. Rook is hanging. So basically there was no chance to very survive. Nice yeah, yeah, very nice win. Mm -hmm. Yeah, even uh, at the end, I mean, with this sacrifice mm -hmm. and uh, Queen G4 threatening the mate to G1 and sacrificing the rook, mm -hmm. beautiful win by Christiansen. And uh, it seems that in this ma in uh, uh, this match, actually, uh, Alexandro beat uh, uh, Brede Kvistvik. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, but actually, I think that Brede is uh, uh, well known. Uh, he's uh, actually, you can recognize him as a Magnus official doctor yes. on the matches <laughs> so <laughs> i mean uh, he he has uh, also other uh, other, other <laughs> things to do i mean no. in the club also he is here as doctor of our club i mean uh, of, of valerenga, valerenga. Okay. and the last game in this match is actually 
Saga for Smagneo against uh, Landa. It's actually interesting because uh, instead of youngsters in this team, other guys are basically not even professionals. So Saga for Smagne. Uh, okay, it seems that uh, wow, seems that uh, maybe Valrenga will even win the match, yeah. <laughs> because after a five, I mean, everything looks uh, yeah. Landa is in big trouble because uh, E3, I mean, can be even uh, met with rookie one move. I don't know what. Uh, after E3, okay, I can play of course A5 and just uh, get one tempo. Uh, rook D6. After Rook D6 and maybe now something like uh, B5, but uh, no. Also, B5. King D3 looks like I will have just some pawn up, but uh, okay, maybe Rook E1 first. I don't know. Now you play King E4, I guess. Mm -hmm. and, uh, now here, even I can push B5. Very nice move, actually. Ah, yes, bishop because B5 now because now I yeah rook d5 mm -hmm. is met with bishop c6 oh, of course. Okay. If you take king d5, then you have the problem because uh, another mm -hmm. pawn is hanging, and even now rook d3 is uh, just uh, mm -hmm. almost Threat. winning. So I think mm -hmm. that uh, okay, actually, yeah, but this would be the end then for Belorechens because if they lose today this match, mm -hmm. yesterday they lost to Sokar. I mean, mm -hmm. you cannot expect anything. I mean, even if they win this uh, last three matches, it's very hard to expect that they can get the medal. Mm -hmm. So it's very important uh, now for them to even save the match. Mm -hmm. Then they are getting some chances. I mean, still they are also are, uh, they are actually holding the chances. Yeah, rook f one was uh, actually yeah rook f six. Uh, Landa, it seems that Landa knows what he's doing. He likes to he would like to push the c three, but I don't believe so much in uh, <laughs> black's position. In at least at least I should <laughs> be able to to help the draw here. Yes, yeah. of course. Why so it would be this. Uh, I think this would be the <coughs> the biggest surprise today, mm -hmm. if they hold draw. But uh, and because if you check their, uh, yeah, you can check the the the, uh, the graphic. I mean, uh, Alec, uh, for example, on the RAS board, Tregubov against uh, Uvea. I mean, the difference is almost. Uh, uh, 450 400. points, mm -hmm. yeah, it's uh, only 350 points and th then you have uh, Alexandro who actually he won the game but it, it seems it will not be enough since Rublevsky lost to Kristiansen mm -hmm. and uh, also Malachov against Tari Arian. Uh, basically Tari is, uh, or the car uh, he's currently the, the most promising uh, young player mm -hmm. from Norway, I mean. He is, uh, uh, now he will turn 17, I think, and mm -hmm. with 521, and he's improving all the time. I mm -hmm. mean, also the, uh, also Johan Sebastian, uh, Christiansen, and uh, one more player, there is one more young player, I mean, Christian Stovik Holm. Uh, in uh, past games, he had a couple of good positions, mm -hmm. uh, and today he did not play, but uh, we see that this was good decision by the captain <laughs> of this team currently. Romanov is uh, mm -hmm. captain. Uh, of this of team, this I mean team? leading the team, yeah. So very, very nice and uh, yeah, uh, result. And I guess it's a huge upset for uh, university. I don't know what. Uh, I I don't see the 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 way they win the match. I mean, mm -hmm. it's. Uh, I I I would not. Uh, I can, uh, I just don't think that Magne can lose this position. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, I think he will at least hold. Mm -hmm. So. Okay, let's check yeah. some other games. Yeah, yeah, we games? can check other games, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, we'll come back. Skip yeah, we can see two. actually what is happening in the uh, women's section because mm -hmm. uh, I okay. think there is not so many games, games. going on anymore. So, there is just two <coughs> games and uh, let's see, yeah, still Stefanova is playing, yeah? Mm -hmm. um, so... Yes, okay, let's see. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, obviously that... Uh, I did not uh, understand this uh, king of three and king of two move because what is happening now if I take on e4? I don't know. I'm, I'm just looking for. Mm -hmm, because here we, we stopped here and actually yeah. after king of three, bishop d3, and it seems that uh, okay, now white should push these pawns, but maybe it's not so easy. Somehow, maybe it's best to give this bishop, I mean, but let's see. This one, bishop c2, and why king f2? I mean, uh, I do not understand this move, this last move, king f2. I mean, I don't know. Because I, black what is happening after bishop b4? Can I take it? b4, just a second. Mm. It 
looks like uh, now. So I don't have many moves. I can. But now why to lose uh, also this? Yes. Okay, maybe she will play like this. Maybe she she is satisfied. No, no, but uh, even uh, no, no. This is uh, this will Moving. be lost. Uh, this yes, will be this is lost endgame. Mm -hmm. So why king f two? I mean, uh, it seems to me like big blunder. Why not bishop f six? Okay. Ah, the problem is that the uh, problem is that bishop f six is actually met with bishop d one. Mm -hmm. Check and now and there is no good squares. I mean, king mm -hmm. f two, rook e four. Now you have to play king e one, but it seems that this position is problem. King will come to e five, king d six, king e five. It's hanging another pawn to e h four, mm -hmm. and yeah. Somehow Maybe it she was missed. better for white to give uh, that pawn on. Of course, she should give pawn on h four. Uh, on h four. On some way, at least. Uh, I mean, uh, I think that uh, maybe she, think she was uh, able to play this. this uh, end game is a draw, so. No, no, but this cannot be drawn. Okay, I, mean, I just said uh, maybe she, uh, she think. Uh, I'm, I'm not so sure. I mean, uh, maybe she was just yeah, 94, 94. She cannot save pawn, and it seems that this will be win for mm -hmm. uh, maybe very important win actually for. Uh, for uh, Gambit. Yes. Because we saw that uh, Bianca made the draw against Goryanchkina, Lanchava, I, I had a feeling that she, she will not lose against Shang Yang, and I don't know what happened in the... With Sadukaso, we didn't... We, we did not uh, check this game, but... Uh, this game, and uh, we should. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, where is... Ah, it's already finished, it seems. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she Lukaso won, so won. actually mm -hmm. this is... Uh, this means that uh, Gambit will win uh, today's match. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, let's just uh, check uh, what, is ha what is happening in this endgame. Well, uh, doesn't seem also really good. Okay. Black will win this position, yes? Okay, it's only Black who is playing on win. Mm -hmm. I mean, basically, uh, in order to draw, maybe, okay, King e3. The problem, main main problem is actually after King E3, this check all the time. I mean, maybe even at uh, some other stage, but uh, it seems now like King E4. Okay, it's still not so easy. I, mm -hmm. I don't think that uh, I should lose this position actually. King D5. I don't see the reason. Okay, because uh, if you take here, mm -hmm. I will have this really active D pawn. Mm -hmm. So yes. it should be raw, but uh, it is not enough. It, it, it is not enough since Stefanova is winning. Uh, I guess she will win uh, this position. Okay, only chance... Uh, uh, for why? Uh, for for uh, actually, I don't see that. Yeah, here, to win this position, it's very tough with black mm -hmm. pieces. But, okay, they don't need it also. Yes. So, I don't think that uh, Shen Yang will really so press it and try Gambit to risk... Will, uh, win this match. Yeah, yeah, Gambit, uh, Gambit will win this match, mm -hmm. this is for sure. Because mm, Stefanova is just mm -hmm. winning uh, second, uh, she's winning the pawn. And, uh, and Sadukasa also. And the only game which uh, had left is uh, Belenkaya against uh, Kovaleska. Mm -hmm. This is match on the third board, yeah? Mm, yes. Against SPB from and Russia and uh, Legacy yes, Square from Russia. Yeah. So let's just... Two uh, rush team. Well. Yes. Seems to me to be drawish, but uh, maybe I'm making a mistake. Uh, it seems drawish to me. I mean, uh, just rook c2, and uh, mm -hmm. this will be soon finished as draw. Maybe it's some e4 check is working, actually. Maybe I'm wrong, uh, because king d2, I can give maybe this check. But okay, this should not be uh, the big problem. Mm -hmm. uh, it's king e4. Well, it's maybe the maybe it's problem. Because the king is uh, okay, king e4, g4, g4 is not the problem. Uh -huh. yeah, it's, uh, yeah, this will be very easy draw. So uh, I think it's time that we go back to see what to happened in uh, in open okay. section because uh, we have a couple of interesting games there. Mm -hmm. So Nakamura made the draw. Mm -hmm. So let's let's see just what happened. After Nakamura, uh, yeah, we stopped uh, after king e3 here, mm -hmm. but. Uh, G5, and okay, this is just uh, king f3, and okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as we said, okay. uh, it's draw cannot be avoided. And uh, in this match, it means that only uh, Topalov is Topalov? playing. But uh, okay, Soccer already won match because Topalov will not lose 
with the pound, uh, end game mm. with the extra pound. <laughs> I mean, he will not lose it. So, uh, and anyway, it's the already 3 2 for soccer. So, it seems that tomorrow uh, we will have a. Uh, Rook ending is. Uh, well, it should be winning, I think. King should come to. Okay, maybe it's not so easy still. But uh, there is many, many options, I mean, in this position. Even on four on three, if we say it's, uh, it will be very, very unpleasant maybe because... Forwards, maybe. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, I think that Topalo is actually thinking about pushing G4. Because uh, exactly mm -hmm. in this moment, he can try to push this position. Uh, of course, that uh, uh, Leko will try to exchange one more mm -hmm. pound. But for now, it doesn't look like possible. I play rook d8, rook d5, take. Mm -hmm. Maybe also this position, simply if I play rook d8, it looks very tough. I mean, you take mm -hmm. rook c6, I take uh, rook d5, five, and uh, now, okay, g6 or king g6, king I g6. guess. Mm. Okay, the king g no, king g6, okay, I give check, rook mm -hmm. g5, you have to go king h6, then I come rook e5. Mm -hmm. And now you have weaknesses all the way mm -hmm. here. And uh, okay, after rook c4, I mean uh, slowly g4. And AG4, King G3, and now it's problem what to do with the black pieces, just uh, in long term. Okay, this is the probably only defensive idea, mm -hmm. but uh, I'm oh well, I'm here somehow, not really optimistic, since after Rook E7. Maybe seven. I can play H5. Mm, no, uh, oh no. No, or rook d5, rook d4. I mean, this is another way, but rook d5 mm -hmm. actually, rook c7 and rook d4, rook e7, and the game black is holding. But uh, here, maybe just first rook e7, for example, and because g5 is losing to mm -hmm. rook e6, king h5, rook e5, and uh, mm -hmm. if black uh, loses another okay. pawn, it's, the, it's, it's simply end of the game. And now after rook e4, it's time to, to maybe even play first rook f7 here. Mm -hmm. And slowly king is coming, king f4, mm -hmm. and uh, still king, uh, king f4, king e5, rook f4. This is like the way you will win the pawn, and it's uh, not so easy. For example, rook b4, if you wait, I just play king f4. Now this is uh, nothing, okay. king e4. Okay, you can go back actually, but uh, this should be a tough position for f4. black. E4, mm -hmm. maybe even F4, as you said, mm -hmm. to have it after G5, mm -hmm. F5. But this should be like generally idea. And if you wait just with the, uh, in this position, just, I mean, I come here mm -hmm. and uh, King E5, and now let's say Rook B4, Rook E4, and finally Topalo I'm taking pawn. Topalo played C7, yes. Okay, Topalo will, uh, he will actually, ah, uh, Topalo will do a little bit uh, another thing, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, after C7, now, King, now, yeah. now, now mm -hmm. Rook C1 should be, should be the move. Uh -huh. He played already g6, sorry. Uh, so no, king f1 now should be the move. Because I can just uh, move the king can to I d1. Play g4? Of course, g4, as you said, is also. I think maybe it's better yeah, to go with king yeah, this g3, is f4, e5. Yeah, this is actually winning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, uh, I cannot imagine that, uh, that Leko will hold this position. Mm -hmm. So. And it seems also that uh, we'll have uh, uh, one match 3-3, like Alkaloid against uh, Novibor. Mm -hmm. uh, since uh, we knew already that there was uh, five draws, and now we'll go for this last game, Yu Yangi against, uh, 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 sorry, Hrachak uh, against Yu Yangi. And uh, <coughs> let's see that game. Hrachak against uh, Yu Yangi, just to find Yu Yangi. Uh -huh. Okay, they are still playing. Uh, yeah, okay, Yu Yang is trying to push this position, I mean, but uh, I do not uh, I do not believe in it. Mm -hmm. And, okay, Legacy Square won today, but uh, they lost this match to, uh, they lost yesterday match to, to si Siberia and, uh, okay, it's, uh, it was probably easier match for them today mm -hmm. because they were playing against Hamburger and it was expected to see them winning. Mm -hmm. This match, uh, okay. This position still, white has to work. I mean, it's uh, it's not so easy because king on h3 looks also slightly uh, just uh, uh, it's not good position, mm -hmm. you know. And, uh, somehow white should take the pawn on e3, and uh, it's not uh, for now. I don't see a real way. Maybe rook f3 is the move here, but 
slowly like he's preparing rook a6 so i think that now he has to take care what has to take care about rook a6 mm -hmm. and then if your pieces get uh, pass, uh, passive passive okay it's it's quite bad actually queen e6 is also threatened a2 mm -hmm. at some point so it's not easy to play this position mm, yeah it seems that actually we young can, uh, mm -hmm. can win this position it's not easy to to win with black and to uh, hold this position with white so yeah yeah, so yeah it's it's unpleasant <laughs> maybe maybe i'm able to play move rook a4 mm -hmm. but uh, now this check on e6 at the beginning is at least uh, very unpleasant. So king g2 is mate, of course. King h4 is not really uh, look. It's not something which I would play because after f5, queen h6 is the mate. Mm -hmm. So it's not. Now it's we not can good just check woman's section because uh, Nona won again. And uh, Macedonian oh, team uh, Gambit also won match, and uh, Legacy Square uh, will win. Although yeah, I think that everything is clear there. Yeah, yes. mm -hmm. it's uh, uh, let's see. Like uh, okay, we said that this will be draw. Mm -hmm. uh, G four. Hmm. Mm, strange move. At least uh, in my opinion, it gives now extra chances. E four. No. G4 now, I, I don't know what is happening, but D4 looks quite dangerous. King e uh -huh. King D2, so I mean, only move, I can but play now. F4 no and uh, but now I can sorry. take this. And oh now I'm not so sure are you able to make a draw after King D4. Mm. Even H6 actually it looks uh, quite logical. Will you make a draw? Yes, you will. Uh, if I play oh, king, king e5, five is the king e5, king e3. This is the only chance. And, uh, and h6 is the problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is. I don't know why why she played g4. I mean, she even she spent uh, almost uh, she spent more than 15 minutes. But uh, g4 looks strange. Did I miss something after rook c2? I don't believe. I think she missed simply Maybe to have this. Maybe missed uh, something. No, I don't. Uh, I don't think so. I think this was just a blunder because Rook no. C2 was obviously, at least, yeah, it's just mm -hmm. obviously drawing. You cannot do anything there. Uh, so, yeah, it's big blunder. I think that after G4, E4, it will be soon. Mm -hmm. And but uh, does it have any influence on the match? Uh, mm -hmm. Since uh, already Kostenyuk won the game and uh, no. Yeah, they won that match. Won, yeah, yes, yes. No, but Gunina lost. Yes, but even Gunina lost. They won because of. Uh, no, I'm not so sure. Kostenyuk won. And uh, Balayan. Okay, I'm looking for a Legacy Square. Now I will see Kostenyuk Sky lost, Balayan. Kostenyuk it's won. still, it's still in progress. Aha, this is a. Uh, okay. Only Kostenskaya can play it and win. So, mm -hmm. yeah. It seems that uh, Legacy, Legacy Square, Square will, will, will merge. Will yeah. But anyway, I think everything is uh, more or less clear here mm -hmm. because uh, Nona is just uh, uh, winning all the matches. Uh, it's okay. just uh, mm -hmm. nobody stops them. Yeah. Second place, third place. <laughs> yeah, and, and uh, okay, it's good to see actually Macedonian team uh, winning today, and uh, they are still on the. They ha still have extremely good chances mm -hmm. to take. Uh, uh, at least silver, and uh, uh, I think that it was today very exciting day. Stefanova um, is playing uh, very good here. She 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 won against Srebrenic, and uh, she won against Bod okay, and the draw with Jagnitz, yeah. and today she okay, will also won. Yeah. Okay. This will be interesting. Yeah, uh, interesting game, actually to so see for individual medals. Mm -hmm. Will yes. Nana takes for um, uh, gold medal in first place or? Or uh, Stefanova. Stefanova. Uh, so, okay, we can say something. Uh, I think that soon we will finish our broadcast. So we saw we actually uh, finished uh, all important matches. Soccer won the match, and uh, then we have on second board uh, the Siberia 
-hmm. his winning match, we, we think that uh, actually Yu Yangi will win this position at the mm -hmm. end. So uh, it seems that we'll have three teams with the maximum number of points and tomorrow will be a more exciting day. I think it was enough for today. What do you think? See Sandra? you tomorrow. Yeah. See you tomorrow <laughs> and uh, thanks for watching us. Yes. Bye. Bye bye. Come. Chess.com is social. Now you can play chess with your friends whenever you want, whether that's middle of the day or middle of the night. You can get instantly matched up with one of over 5 million other members from around the world. You play live games in real time, turn based games at your convenience, or tournaments with anyone at any time. Chess.com is mobile. You can play online from your computer, or you can play on the go from your tablet or your smartphone. No matter where you go, whether you're at work, grabbing a bite to eat, or you're just enjoying some time at the park, your games are there with you, and keeping multiple chess games going has never been easier. Chess.com is for learning. Don't just play chess, get better. The best chess training resources have never been more accessible. Learn essential chess strategy quickly and easily with the extremely popular Tactics Trainer Tool. Improve your game in ways you didn't know were possible with training videos by chess masters. And regardless of where you're at now, take your game to the next level with multiple simple to use training tools. Chess.com is for everyone. Over 250 million chess games have been played on Chess.com. And it doesn't matter if you're a beginner or a grandmaster. Chess.com is the place to play and learn chess. So create your free account now see what chess.com is for you.